Guys, thank you so much for buying the Trash Taste Tour tickets. We've sold out in so many venues, so much so that we're actually adding an extra show. An extra show in Los Angeles on the 23rd of September. The first LA show we had sold out pretty much right away. So we wanted to add an extra day and because it's gonna be our first show of the tour, it's gonna be a little tester show. So if you wanna see an early version of the show, then go to TrashTasteTour.com. That is TrashTasteTour.com. So come see us live, get your tickets, smash that link. I oh, yeah. guess I'll smoke crap uh, yeah, you I, and your friends. If I get to hang out with the cool people, I guess I'll smoke crack. Actually, speaking of smoking crack. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. Welcome to another episode of the Trash Taste Podcast. I'm Woo. your host for today, Joey. And as always, I am with Woo. the lads, Connor yeah, hello, and Gone. Hello. And we have a special guest sitting next to me. Introduce yourself. Hi guys, I am Pokey, Pokey Main. My actual name's Iman. Feel free to call me any of the above. You guys can also call me Pokey if that's you. <laughs> this, this feels Did like you? a trick. It's like yeah. one, of, one of them is the correct one. Yeah. yeah. Which one? Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Guess which one it is. It's like, like one of them is highly offensive and we're just gonna find out afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait, which one's the derogatory term? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I will admit, confession right off the bat. Okay. I like looked up all of your guys' names so I could make sure I could pronounce them right. I mean, yeah. Connor and like Joey were fine, but I was like- <laughs> Say it, <laughs> say it, say it. Yeah, how, do you, how do you pronounce it? <clears throat> Garnt? Yeah, <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, she got yeah, it, she got yeah, it. Yeah, she got it. Me on the, yeah, yeah. the way. God. <laughs> You pretty thought it was like Grant, right? Yeah, that's what yeah. everyone does. That's what well, I was like, is this a typo? <laughs> <laughs> that's what everyone thinks. <laughs> and then I watched the video where you guys were like, our names, wrong answers only. And he's yeah. talking about like Granite and then Garnet. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, no. Yeah, I was, I was on like the OTV cast the other day uh -huh. and uh, I was on there with Toast and Skara. And uh, apparently like Skara was the one who was like familiar with my content. He was selling mm. Toast. No, no, no. It's not Gig UK, it's Gigak, okay? Come on, come on. You gotta, you gotta research, you, you gotta research your guests, right? And then immediately afterwards he says, oh no, his name's Grant. It's not Garnt, it's Grant. Grant. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Sorry gosh. to call you out like this, Scar. Scar even yeah. I, better than that. Thank you. Wait, did you correct him? Uh, I, I corrected him before the podcast. Oh, so okay. it, was, it, was, oh, it wasn't on damn, film. That would have been a funny- That would have yeah, been a funny- The entire segment. podcast yeah. 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 like, so great. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And then at the end when it's posted, people in the comment are like, hmm, I'm pretty sure his name isn't Grant. I, I did the, um, the pottery stream with Cutie. Yeah. And I did it and it was really fun. And then I was talking to Minx and I was like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and um, cause Alex was also there. I did a thing uh, and he's Australian. And then yeah. I think, I don't know why I was like, yeah, I live in Japan. And then she's like, yeah, but you're obviously like from Australia, right? And I was like, <laughs> what do you mean? Wait, yeah. Minx thought you were Australian? Yeah, and I'm like, you're Irish. You should know. You have That's no excuse. I'm yeah. like, you have no excuse for not knowing that I British. You sound 1% Australian. I sound nothing Australian. Yeah. I, don't, I, I, I sound nothing Australian. <laughs> is, that, <laughs> is that your impression? <laughs> is that your impression yeah. of Connor? Thank you, I appreciate it. Yeah. I wish I had an accent. Like You do have an accent. Yeah, you do have an you accent. Have an it's an American accent. accent. No. Yeah. Uh, no, I'm leaving LA right now. <laughs> Bye guys, it was nice knowing you. Okay, cause I grew up in Canada. I was born in Morocco. My first language is French. Oh. And so I think when I first moved to LA, I had a bit of like a Canadian accent. Right, mm. you lose Bagel. that, it goes, right? Um, but I do find myself sometimes sounding a little bit LA-esque and it's very scary. <laughs> I, I don't know, like that. that's, that's my boundary in yeah. life. Right. As right. soon as someone tells me I start sounding like a, like a valley girl, I have to go. I Wait, have do, to go back to my roots. Do you do like the, oh my fucking God, like that kind of vibe. <laughs> the issue is you hear those kind of things so much. Yeah. Yeah. And then sometimes you'll say it ironically because it feels funny and good to say ironically. And all of a sudden, it's not so <laughs> it's, ironic, it's like, it's is like bro. it? Everyone would say bro ironically. Bro. And, yeah, that, and now just, everyone says bro. It's yes. like saying bussin or like lit no, or like no. any that's, internet term. That's me and Among Us. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Among Us. Sassy, yeah. <laughs> oh no. Yeah. It is though, it is. And at first I'm like, this is like cringe as fuck. Among Us, why would people laugh at Among Us? And then I start laughing at Among Us uncontrollably. <laughs> Five months in, I'm like, okay, okay. Yeah, we learned from the charity stream that Garn's funny bone is just someone saying Among Us, but just just bass boosted. <laughs> and you'll just laugh just at it like every Michael. time. Just yeah. Like yeah, exactly. Yeah. I, I, do you get like annoyed when people are like, you don't sound Canadian anymore. I feel like attacked when people say that to me when they're like, you don't sound British enough. I know what you mean. Yeah. 
You're like, I was fucking born there. What do you that mean? How is this right now? Like, I feel really. <laughs> <laughs> I thought this was a safe space for like a podcast. <laughs> feeling. Wait, wait. So how how long were you in Canada for? Um, for between the ages of four to twenty ish, so like sixteen years. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Be honest with me, and like, I can take it. How American do I sound? Oh uh, yeah, like very. Like a hundred percent. Yeah, I, I did. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 could, I American could. or like. I live in LA. No, America, just American. Just American, American. Because like <laughs> American, American guys be nice. like saying American accent is just like the most neutral accent you could yeah. ask it's for. It's like right? the default skin in Fortnite. That's what the American accent is. Would you be able is. to tell a Canadian from an American if the Canadian didn't have like an intense Canadian accent? Because I don't think a lot of us no. are out here like no. about no. this bacon no. maple syrup. I mean, there are know? some people, <laughs> there are some people I've met that have like that kind of, you know, a boot yeah, accent. Yeah. But like I've, I've met so many creators just on this trip alone yeah. where I'm like, I always thought you were American <laughs> until you told me like, like yeah. you for example, yeah. like I didn't know you were Canadian. You know, yeah, so that, it's that like, a lot. It's, yeah. it's really hard to hear sometimes. Yeah. I mean, obviously if you're like, you know, from Quebec or something, or like, you know, where it's like a if very strong XQC, accent, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, obviously yeah, yeah. if you're XQC, I can tell you're not quite from America, but like, yeah, from your accent, I have no idea. Oh, you yeah. just sound American yeah. to me. For, for me, I can't tell the difference between American and Canadian accents, but sometimes you get like, you meet someone and they just like, they have the Canadian energy, you know what I mean? <laughs> Like, That's true. Wait, That's what true. is the Canadian energy? I can tell you. The Canadian okay. energy is when you go into a place and you say, hey, can I go to the bathroom, the toilet? Not like the washroom or like, where can I go? <laughs> you know, it's like specific words. Wait, I and thought, when you say bagel. I thought, I, thought, I thought bathroom was like what Americans say. But is a washroom? I've never other, heard anyone say washroom. I've yeah. never heard anyone say And then it's probably yeah. washroom. Yeah. Do, do they say toilet in America? Can I go to the toilet? Fre like in French, they say toilet. Oh. In America, I don't even. Do I don't. I, I mostly hear the word bathroom. Yeah. yeah. Like, okay. Where? Then I meant washroom. I okay. think when I first came to LA, I used to say washroom a lot. And people I'm like, were like, oh, fuck. Yeah. Washroom. It's kind of like when you're an American, you just say, "Where's the loo?" You know. <laughs> I, I don't know. Well, Where's the like, loo? I we say we say that we say toilet in the UK, right? Yeah, we say toilet. We say toilet. Oh my god! Oh my god! Have you have you forgotten, Connor? I, I, <laughs> have you forgotten? I, I, I do forget because I've been so Americanized. I know. Me <laughs> too. Yeah. And everyone gives me so much shit Copium, for copium. Oh, I, I, I did a fucking stream with Ludwig and, and he made a video about it and it was, oh, I was doing well. And then a lot of the comments were like, I was waiting for the British guy to turn up because there's a British guy in the title. And uh, this guy isn't British. I live, lived in Britain and he doesn't sound British. <laughs> and it's like, oh, oh, just cause my accent changed a little bit. I'm not from the country anymore. Fuck off. You sound okay. pretty fucking British. What? Yeah, yeah. The thing. Pretty fucking British. The, uh, the angry, <laughs> the, <laughs> the more, the louder I get, the more British I sound. But also, if I'm around, <laughs> if I'm, if I'm around British people, it goes British. If I'm around American people, it goes more American. Yeah. Okay. Random thought. We're curious what you guys think. Do you think, like, actors and celebrities that are known for being from a certain place will intentionally try to like continue to force their accent for a really long time? Because I could see that. Like they'll move to America or something, be here for a long time, maybe lose the accent, but then they like have to retrain themselves to keep the accent. Dude, I feel like I like, have to do that. Because like accents are just fucking nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah. he's about to start I, doing I, that. I, I, I swear I have to I, do I'm that. British, I'm British, I swear. So actually I've not been doing that for a very long time. Um, <laughs> I, feel, I feel especially like something about like the American accent is very easily transferred to yeah. non- Well, it's just speaking yeah. clearly. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just it's speaking. You're just, you're just enunciating all your words, yeah. Yeah. except for H, that's, that's the only thing. Uh, you know. yeah. You're gonna say H. Herbs. Yeah. Herb, herbs. That's the yeah. only thing I don't understand. Everything else, I'm like, okay, it makes sense why you kind of like made it very clear and very enunciated. That's how you say it, right? Yeah, enunciated. Enunciated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and yeah. the other thing is, um, <laughs> <laughs> I, I heard that. Listen, British accents are so fun to do. Okay. <laughs> I don't actually have it, so let me pretend. I, yeah, I have friends that bully me as well. Like oh, Tuesday, water. Yeah, you're, you're fucking water. water. Yeah, fuck it. Uh. <laughs> Gotta upload a video to you YouTube. <laughs> um, Canadians say X Y Z, not X Y Z. We say X Y Z as well. Yeah, really? yeah, yeah same with the British. Z. Hell yeah. My man. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Canadians say Z. Z. Yeah. Oh yeah, we say Z. Z. So well, it's because you used to be Britain. <laughs> I guess like just most copium. So everywhere is copium. Have the rights to this accent as well? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> you absolutely like not. Every now and then. How it depends how shit it is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's well, that's how we that's how we decide if we're offended yeah, yeah, yeah. or not, right? It's like if you if your accent's really shit, then it's yeah. just like, all right, you better work on it before you talk to me. Again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you feel like uh, you've a bond to the queen as your as your head of state? 
growing <laughs> up a little bit because I think we were taught no I kid you not okay. we were taught that quite a bit in school but yeah. then afterwards I'm like queen who what yeah. I'm not American I'm not Canadian yeah, yeah. I, I belong to the world <laughs> I'm, I'm a citizen of the world yeah. thank oh, you very one much of those. I'm, oh, an, I'm yeah, an earthling yeah. the world <laughs> so can you go back to your like I guess like your accent you grew up with anytime you want to, because- I guess it wasn't that much of an- Well, it depends like whereabouts in Canada were you from? Like, were you from like Vancouver or like- <laughs> I was from middle of buff like nowhere a little bit. Okay, okay, okay. Calgary? <laughs> no, okay, actually the accents that you guys probably think of when you think of Canadian accents mm. are from the like middle provinces. Yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. Right. Like Manitoba, Alberta. Yeah. 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 Very who megalol. Mm. I'm the kind of who megalol that's like, I'm two hours from Toronto. Oh. So I pretend I'm from Toronto, but I'm not. I'm right, from right. a very boring little city. Right, 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 right. right. Nice. So you have the small town rep, right? I a guess. A little bit. Yeah. Just a small town girl. Oh, no, <laughs> no, honestly, the older I get, the m this sounds so boomer, the more appreciative I am of my upcoming mm -hmm. because I feel like it was just so chill, like yeah. small, pretty wholesome, like, kind of multicultural town mm -hmm. and living in America, you I feel like you are much more exposed oh, yeah. to yeah. all the downsides well, of living in America. Well, not, <laughs> not just living How in America, you're, you're living in LA as well, you know, yeah. in a very, very intense city. It's couldn't be pretty much the opposite of what you grew up in. Exactly, so yeah. It's so, so yeah, we always ask this to every L person who now lives in LA. Do you enjoy LA. living in LA? Define enjoy. <laughs> because I swear every person we've met just on this trip alone who lives here is just like, yeah, so so what's it like living in LA? And 90% of them are like, it's shit, <laughs> but I can't I, leave. I can't say it's shit, mm. but you do feel a little bit like a prisoner. Right. <laughs> Sorry, not <laughs> I, prison, a prisoner. Prison, nice. like, sure. who, no, 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 let me explain. Like how you can feel imprisoned in like a toxic relationship. <laughs> Okay. That's the okay. best way to put it. It's like, right. I just can't Chains leave. Chains of the mind. <laughs> okay. But yeah, there right. are major downsides, but yeah. there are major upsides. Right. Yeah. So I can't say it's great, like yeah. a very loving and warm I mean, prison has upsides as well. You know, you yeah. get free, free food, food. Yeah. free accommodation, you know, there's this, this an upside to prison, I guess right? there's some things. No, okay. <laughs> LA is really not that bad. Obviously or else mm. I wouldn't live there. Yeah. Um, But it, it really is, it's a toxic relationship. <laughs> right. Yeah. Would you ever consider moving out if, you know, you, you don't want it to take some time I off on your Twitch I or whatever? I very much would. I think for starters, I could not possibly imagine raising a family in Los Angeles. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know how people do that. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't. But the weirder part still is- Still trying to figure out sex. Just, yeah. just, just literally- they're waiting, they're waiting for marriage. Just right? waiting for the story. Listen, just it's not the baby out. having part, it's the part <laughs> after that. Know. Think about this. Know, the next time yeah. you guys are out, just think about, I guess like how many kids you see. Oh, you don't and see any, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Unless you're in like Where a do the really babies go? Oh. Where do the babies go? <laughs> <laughs> they, get, they get shipped off to other parts of America. Like, yeah. <laughs> Q X Files theme. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta say, it is weird <laughs> walking past high schools in the middle of fucking like Hollywood. Yeah. And, then, yeah. and just seeing like barricades on these schools. Mm. Like I couldn't imagine going to a school that looks like a prison. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And I mean, that's that's why, like, I'm really grateful. I feel like I grew up, albeit maybe it was a little bit like a naive way to grow up. I think oh, yeah. it's good to be a little more on the sheltered. Well, have when some you're very naivety young. while yeah, you still yeah. can. Exactly. Mm -hmm. The moment you go online, it's all gone. So yeah. why not yeah. enjoy it? Well, how, and, how long have you lived in LA? Uh, about five years. Five years. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So like f four years in like streamer houses. Mm. One what's, 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 plus. What's, what's, yeah, what, yeah, well, what's, 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 oh, what's sorry, this? I say what's this because some of them were, most of them were officially streamer houses. Like I lived with OTV, yeah. but then I lived with streamers, but we okay. weren't, like we were a house of right, content right, creators, right. but we didn't like make content right. together yeah, for yeah, that yeah, purpose. Yeah, right, yeah right, right, and right. then I decided to live alone, which is- Enjoying it so far? <laughs> Yeah. Much <laughs> yeah, yeah, because uh, when po yeah when Pokey first came here, we were like apologizing for how messy our house is, which to me, which I look is. at our house, it's a fucking mess, yeah, by which the way. it is. And she was like, no, 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 this this is like a clean house, and I'm like, D we haven't vacuumed in two weeks because this house for some reason doesn't have a vacuum. So it's it's like I it doesn't see have a lot of things. mess. Yeah. So when like, it comes to cleanliness, after being in like content creator houses for four years. 
my standards are on the ground. <laughs> can I, and everything else is on the ground too. <laughs> can I ask can I, what, can I, yeah, what's the most gross thing you've seen in yeah. the Contact Grid house? Is it, you don't you have know, to name it's names. It's kind of BM because like, I live there. Like, I'm not I'm saying BM. I'm the cleanest person. <laughs> I'm saying it's just messy. Um, but very much like, it's typically like junk or like food stuff. Yeah. Right. Mm. Especially because <laughs> you usually don't have designated people for specific tasks. Right. Like yeah, yeah. taking out the trash. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The Cause you're all divas. fruit flies invade. <laughs> oh. yeah. And then we got those little like zapper thingies. Oh, you guys yeah, 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 yeah. Leave them, And every now and then you hear a large zap cause it's a fly who's <laughs> like dead. <laughs> <laughs> and everyone turns around like, just another dead fly. <laughs> yeah, because it, it just kind of sounds like a frat house, right? Because no, I was, yeah. yeah, I was gonna yeah. ask, do you, do you, did you have like a cleaning rota where you know you take turns cleaning the house, or was it just whoever was like the most disgusted first cleaned the house? Hey, to be fair, we would have cleaners come every maybe like two weeks. Um, it's just, it's hard to manage that many people mm. without having someone be like, you do this and you do this and you do that. And when you're in a group of friends, like no one really wants to do that, mm. right? Mm. Of course. And I, I I think I ended up not being the cleanest either, but I would just try to be as messy as possible in my room. Right, <laughs> right, right, right. So it's your Contain responsibility. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. yeah, yeah, yeah. And that then I sense. get bothered by myself and I have to clean up after myself and right. run. Right. right. How's your apartment now then? Is it is it clean? Is it spick and spam or is it is it the same, the same pokey streamer house? I think it's pretty nice right now. Mm. I still have a lot of like moving, unpacking and we'll, stuff. We'll ask you again in two weeks and see if, see if the answer is the same. <laughs> Let me know. Yeah, if you've just moved in, that doesn't count. Cause yeah, it's, yeah. It's, 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 it's always, always, it's always clean. messy. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and then for me, it's like, my environment is a reflection of my brain. Like if I'm stressed before a trip, mm. everything's everywhere and I'm gone. Cause yeah. I just like spent the last five hours packing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh no, yeah. but like the worst feeling is when you come back, you're fucking exhausted from the flight. You've you've had a great time and you come back and the house is a fucking mess. Yeah. Life just... hack, get a cleaner while you're gone. <sighs> See money. You come up. home and you're like, I live here. It feels very like mommy, <laughs> yeah. like your mom cleaned, you know? Honestly, you're that's- like, Wow, family. <laughs> no, it's just a cleaner. You paid like a hundred dollars to clean. Honestly, that's that's what I love staying about in like about staying about in hotels. You know, mm. you go you go out, you go out. Yeah. You, 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 the rooms are fucking mess, and you're like, I know it's gonna be clean when it come when I come yes, back. Sir. Yeah, I yes, know it's sir. gonna be spick and spam, and I can have a good night's sleep. So yeah. yeah. So you've obviously um like moving on now from like to like the Twitch stuff, right? Because it's like, how long have you been doing Twitch now? I, I feel like you've been on the platform forever. Like nine years? Jesus. Oh Eight to nine years, somewhere in between there. Oh my God. That's insane. You still Long enjoying time. it, obviously? <laughs> <laughs> or is that a loaded question? Like this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Obviously, generally net positive. Mm. Right. Um, well, it's like YouTube, I I, you know, it. yeah. Yeah, it's just like YouTube. So but, you, but you've seen the platform right. change so much, so right? Much. Like it's completely different. Cause like, obviously I haven't been doing it as long as you, but like even just in the short amount of time I've been doing Twitch, it's like changed fucking dramatically, right? Not just the platform, but the audience. Mm, right. Um, <laughs> it becomes cool. like more diversified with every year, which I can't say enough how much I appreciate. Right, yeah. right. You mean like mm. with, in terms of the countries or just in general interest and everything like that? In general interests, gender espe especially. Mm, uh, mm. Countries a little bit, but I feel like it kind of grows everywhere right. all at once. Right, right. Yeah. Yeah, because I guess when you started, was it mostly males that Absolutely. were on Twitch? Absolutely. Well, yeah, you played League, right? Yeah. Oh, so that's Boy. just. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. Thank you. Yeah, we, we, we all. I appreciate my condolences. That. Yeah. <laughs> we we both played a lot of League. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we both played a lot of League, so we get it as well. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, do you guys remember, like, back in the day, especially mm. when League was always, like, the most popular game yeah. on Twitch? Mm hmm. What was like running rampant was these videos talking about like female Twitch streamers and cleavage. Like that was the yeah. thing. Yeah. Oh, that yeah, was yeah, the yeah. clickbait everywhere. And it was like, almost like this propaganda that spread <laughs> across. And it was like, this is where you find, you know, girls- Hot single ladies in your area. <laughs> Hot and single league players in your area. Yeah. They and don't that exist. Was like, they don't. Because, <laughs> they don't. because Twitch was so new, that was like the first thing to like virally mm. circulate mm. about female streamers. Mm. Oh my God, she right. wore this. Oh my God, she did that. She was donated this much. And it's just been like so, so many years and yeah. so much work to kind of move past that and be like, yeah. there's women of all types, just like in real life. Yeah, <laughs> right, know? who knew? Yeah, <laughs> what a shock. 
Yeah, so how have you like dealt with that kind of culture? Because if, if there's anyone who's gone through like, we've talked about, we've talked a lot about, you know, toxic online culture, mm. a lot on our podcast, but if there's anyone who's been through toxic <laughs> online culture, <laughs> It is you. Yeah. So if there's someone we could we could actually you take advice say. from, it's yeah. probably you. You, you, guys you need you're... advice? What's wrong? Oh, well, you've been on Talk like to me. you've been on like <laughs> the. <laughs> I, I'm good. I Nothing, just want to yeah. hear your perspective. Nothing's, yeah, yeah, no, nothing's no. inherently wrong, but like you've been on the forefront of literally every war or battle when it comes to that I side of things on the internet. Stuff. Yeah, you yeah, are. Yeah. So it's like, I don't know. It's just, I think it'd be really interesting to hear from your perspective about like what you've seen and what you've gone through. Yeah. And like your honest opinions on it. Yeah, sure. Um, where do I even start? <laughs> How do you begin? Like yeah. what, what's yeah. the start For of this? For starters, again, I think I was really naive. Right. Like mm. I came on Twitch just to make friends to play video games. With. Cause in no. this small town, I knew like two people, two girls mm, and right. like four guys that I would game with sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, I think yeah, that's yeah, why yeah. we started making YouTube videos as well. Yeah. Like we just yeah. want friends. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. And like the two girls didn't even play games anymore. And I'm like, I need friends. You know, I was 17, just wanted to have fun. Yeah. Right. And I kept doing it uh, part time. And I have been on the internet since I was like 11 or 10. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Like I know that there will always be some weird comments, some oh, yeah. creepy person, some whatever. Yeah, so definitely. I was very accustomed to that. And I grew up with an older brother, so I was very used to bullying. <laughs> I'm kidding, not bullying, but like, if anything, a lot of banter. Like he would talk some shit, I would talk some shit. Yeah. yeah. Now we're besties who play Valorant together, but still. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, so like, I guess I was just very used to that. Yeah, yeah. Um, so streaming, I didn't, like, especially just starting off, I was like, oh, this is normal. You'll get weird comments yeah. here and there. Yeah. But oddly enough, I feel like, let me know if you guys agree, like way back in the day before, all these social platforms and mm. Twitch and content creation in general blew up. Mm. I actually feel like the internet was a little more uh, like almost like wholesome and welcoming because there weren't as many people yeah, who yeah. were that deep into it. Yeah, I, yeah. I was mm. just about to say, it really felt like all the, um, like around 2015, 16, when mm. obviously all the political stuff was happening, yeah. it kind of just shifted into the online thing so with, like, yeah. with all the Me Too stuff as well, where everyone had to pick a side with it. Mm -hmm. yeah. So it was just, it just became this, you versus them. And then if you were a woman online who had, uh, yeah, yeah. And then that, yeah. so I imagine that was that when it yeah, started picking but, up? Absolutely. But like when I was even like 12, 13, 14, yeah. 15, and I would make friends online and someone found out I was a girl, they were actually really nice. Yeah, like yeah, too yeah. Too nice. I have this like, <laughs> no, legit. Oh, slash I have nice this guys. core memory of playing Maple Story and meeting a guy one time right. and he was like, Oh, I'm gonna quit. And he found out I was a girl and he gave me all his loot. Everything. He had been grinding for like three years. And he was like, well, I'm actually that, quitting today. So here's the most, all my That is the most maple story. <laughs> so wait, wait, wait. Like only wait. maple story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So so you, you, had a, you had a sim from age. No, legit. <laughs> I had a maple yeah. story sim. That was my, that was probably my first like simping interaction. Yeah. And, and I could tell in that moment, I was like, I think he's treating this me this way because of my gender, but it's very nice. Yeah. So I'll take it. Well, yeah. Yeah. I mean, as a as a former Maple Story player, yeah. I can I, I can like <laughs> attest to that being like because you know everyone would play the game and obviously yeah. you yeah. could pick like your avatars and whatnot, yeah. but it yeah, was yeah. an actual rare occurrence when it's like you're a female character and, and you're a, a female yes. IRL. Legit, yeah. like girls were like unicorns in the no. gaming sphere, <laughs> yeah, yeah. but in the way where we were like treated much nicer because mm. we were rare. Yeah, yeah. exactly, but exactly. I don't know how this went so south. <laughs> Yo, as, as a former league player, how many times did the jungler camp your lane just when they found out you were a girl? Actually, league, I had, I guess, a different experience because people get very angry. During oh, league, oh you yeah, know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and if anything, that was when I started feeling like, oh, my gender is something to be used against me. Like, yeah, like yeah. oh, if you're not playing well, it's because of this part of you. Right. Like, oh, my genitals dictate how good I am in the game? Odd, but sure. Right. Um, yeah, so I think that's when it like really first started for me. But also with League, I would play a lot with friends and I kind of chalked up a lot of negative experiences to like, oh, just random angry people online. It's just mm. League. That's that's just the League experience at the right? end of the day, right? Yeah. You, were, you were good there, right? You you were like diamond rank, right? Pl I, higher. Dude, when I grinded, I was pretty fucking good at League. Yeah. Like I, I sold you to like D1 or something on Holy stream shit. as well. Wow. Yeah. But like way back in the day. And the thing is like when you're a casual player yeah. and like these are the streams, you know, you have like Tyler One, Jackson, yeah. Double Live, yeah. Yeah. Pokemon, you yeah. know? Yeah, yeah. When 
I'm being compared to these guys who are obviously like insane. Challenges, yeah. And I'm like a casual player, like trying my best above average, but like you have bad games. D1 mm. is better than your entire chat though, probably at that point. Like well, D1 when is When people like, you know, see you have a bad game, they're like, this is my opportunity to say, <laughs> it's cause you're a girl. Right. No, dude, it's cause I'm a casual player and everybody has bad <laughs> games all the time. Like. Yeah. You're not at your peak capabilities 24-7. Yeah. yeah. yeah cool. And streaming exactly. adds on the whole yeah. layer. Yeah. yeah. Like oh, how much pressure was on you as like one of the top, like the top female streamer for like a while to like feel like you had to be like the perfect person or like the perfect role model, even though you're human just like everyone else. A lot. <laughs> <laughs> and and sometimes still to this day, it, it's just a little bit tough because I feel like I have to overthink a lot of the decisions that I make in order for it to reflect mm. well yeah. on mm. this group, an entire gender, if anything, that yeah. I am unintentionally representing. Mm. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, like yeah. when I decide to do something, um, even if it's something as simple as like, I went from playing league to doing like variety content. Yeah. If I don't work my ass off to make that transition work well in my favor, mm -hmm. like, Oh, like finally she like fell off or this or that. Right. You know, you can just people are tell. waiting to celebrate your mm. full. Yeah. yeah, like they're so ready to write whatever negative narrative. You have to work so hard to create a positive one. Yeah. For example, like when I first started streaming, I saw a lot of people, um, like a lot of people when a girl was doing well, they'd be like, Oh, it's because you're dating this person. Yeah. So mm. they would attribute that yeah. female streamer's success to their partner. So I was like, okay, I'm never gonna date anyone publicly. That way, anything I do will be accredited to me. Right. Yeah. I thought. <laughs> <laughs> no, they will just find another way to oh, discredit. Yeah, 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 yeah right? exactly. And exactly. instead it became like a, who is she dating? She's hiding her boyfriend for donations and subs and this and that. And I'm like, <laughs> I'm either doing this bad <laughs> thing no or way. I'm doing, I'm either like, clout chasing if someone is more popular than me or if someone yeah. was less popular than me i'd yeah. be using him yeah. if i had him involved you know yeah like or, or you're pandering to like the simps or something yes, right you yeah. know? anything yeah. you do can be seen negatively that's really what i've learned <laughs> <laughs> my time on the internet so how do you stay positive then <laughs> it's it sounds like illusion <laughs> yeah do you just like i guess it's just like you just stop giving a shit. i guess it's like Partially, yeah. but honestly, what helped me a lot mm. was um, my female streamer friends. Wow. Like if I didn't have them validating me and being like, no, like from an objective perspective, mm -hmm. telling me there are instances, like obviously I, I mess up and I ap apologize for the situations where I do mess up. Mm. Yeah. But I feel like so many things get like convoluted, taken out of context. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. Just narratives being spread like wildfire to make me look bad. If I didn't have other people that I trusted mm. objectively saying like, no, you are being treated unfairly in comparison to other people in similar positions. Yeah. Yeah. I would have gone crazy. <laughs> I yeah. would have like gassed myself to heck. Yeah. But l luckily I did have like a really, really great support system. Okay. And I think like once I got to a point where I realized, oh wow, this is like a male dominated field. Mm. Oh, yeah. with Look at the podcast. <laughs> 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 you guys are the good ones. Oh. <laughs> the, the good ones. The good ones. <laughs> it's because we're not in LA. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> it's gonna see I'm it. Yeah. <laughs> no, but it, it, it was also like, there's been so many weird moments in this industry. For example, mm. even realizing like, I ne especially need the help of other like men in my field, male content creators, male streamers, yeah. because, and as unfortunately misogynistic as this is, mm -hmm. a lot of the audience will only really trust something if it's coming from another guy that they respect. So we need mm -hmm. you guys to say women good for me to be good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you know, you think so? women good. <laughs> women good, guys. <laughs> guys, women good. Yeah, yeah, guys. We all agree with that, right? Right, Connor. Is, right. is that really the case? Is oh, that oh yeah, and it's especially okay. That's so depressing. I'm, I sorry, never thought about it. I, 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 I never, never thought never, about it like that yeah. before. Actually. Sorry, I'm yeah. getting so into the yeah, nitty gritty. We could talk about anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 please, no, no, please this get is actually really interesting. This in particular, there's like so much to go off of. Not just that, yeah, but knowing that and that being very, very clear to me multiple instances, mm. it made me especially sad when this whole like simp narrative became a thing. Yeah. Right. Because then I could very much sense my male friends 
were having a hard time standing up for me or defending me in situations because they didn't want to be deemed, oh, you're just a simp, you're this, yeah. you're that, and yeah. look down upon. Yeah. Yeah. So there was, yeah, there was but, just but, like- Like yeah. God forbid platonic relationships this, exist. This yeah. Yeah. God I, forbid you say something good about a girl. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. the thing I always found weird about that is that there seems to be like, okay, let's say if a, if, if a woman actually was trying to push the, the boyfriend experience and trying to push that, yeah, it's not like guys don't do it inversely. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, yeah. And the exactly. thing that I've never really found, I found really weird is because as a guy, I see other, sometimes I see other content creators really going for that angle of like, I'm I'm like, I'm gonna be your boyfriend or I'm, you know, giving you that experience. This video is sponsored by ExpressVPN. <laughs> Big tech is more powerful than most countries are and they are profiting by exploiting your personal data. How dare they? It's time to put a layer of protection between your online activity and these tech juggernauts. And that's why I use ExpressVPN. Guys, just think about how much of your life is on the internet. All, all. Sadly, every site you visit, every video you watch, every message you send gets tracked and data mined. But when you run ExpressVPN on your device, the software hides your IP address, something Whoa. big tech can use to personally identify you. So ExpressVPN Ooh. makes your activity harder to trace and sell mm. to advertisers. What I like most about ExpressVPN is how easy it is to use. It really is easy to <laughs> no, use. No, it is, it is actually easy. It's one button. Uh, I got it right here on my phone. Just download the app on your phone, computer, tap one button and you're protected. Wow. To stop handing over your personal data to big tech monopolies that mine your activity and sell your information. Protect yourself with a VPN that we trust to keep us safe online. Visit expressvpn.com slash trash taste. That's E-X-P-R-E-S-S-V-P-N dot com slash trash taste to get three months extra for free. Go to expressvpn.com slash trash taste right now to learn more. Back to the episode. It's not like there aren't male creators doing or pushing even further for the whole boyfriend experience of like, I love you so much. You guys mean so much to me. And yeah. oh, by mm. the way, here's my here's my 30 minute ASMR of me telling yeah. me how much I love you. And it's like, people like would never ever, ever criticize people who do that publicly. But it's for some reason, it's okay when it's a woman. I don't yeah. understand. That's another major realization that yeah. was very helpful to me. Cause for a long time I was like, am I doing something wrong? Like people saying simp this, simp that. But I'm like, I don't think I go out of my no, you don't even, way yeah, you don't do to like, like that. do that kind of thing. I just love gaming. Um, I love to do whatever kind of, sorry, whatever kind of content yeah, that yeah. I happen to be in a very male dominated field. Yeah. And then I realized like, wait a second, like so many very, very, very popular guys have female majority audiences mm. yeah. and no one ever uses that as an insult towards them yeah. or uses that to discredit them in any way. Or well, it's yeah. just the filthy double standards, right? It's just like- <laughs> oh, it's, 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 it like, it low key blew my mind. Cause I'm like, uh. especially like most male artists think Justin Bieber when he was young or even BTS now, yeah. mm. or like maybe even some male streamers as well. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And another thing it's is- It's definitely like a bad thing. Yeah. yeah and yeah. another thing as well is like you, you are, it's recently the VTubing trend has like, popped off, right? Mm. And I remember, especially in the early days of VTubing, there were definitely like, it's if if they were a 3D girl, you know, you, you know, we don't yeah. simp for the 3D girls, but it's fine to like simp for the 2D girls, right? And it's fine for the VTubers, like some of the really early VTubers to really play that up, you know? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. And it, like nowadays, now it's, it's, it's the male VTubers that are playing it up and uh, it's completely okay. Oh yeah, I, I, I never thought about yeah, that. Now, yeah, now yeah. it's like, you know, yeah, like some, especially even in Japan, like some of the top uh, VTubers in some industries now are male oriented with massive female oriented audiences because obviously, you know, the idol culture is massive in Japan, right? And yeah. No one bats an eye. Meanwhile, yeah. 3D streamer who's a female does it and everyone yeah. loses their minds, right? Yeah, I always thought- I, oh, oh, sorry. Go, go for it. I also think maybe one of the reasons why is because I feel like VTubing and VTubers in general um, appeal to an audience to whom like that maybe isn't as weird or they're not like as ready. Like if you watch anime, there probably is a waifu that you love, right? right. Um, so for that to be a VTuber instead and be a streamer, like that's probably a cool experience for you. Mm. Yeah. Whereas mm. when it comes to gaming, <laughs> over time I learned there are you know, a lot of people that might tend to be more misogynistic. I don't know the right way to see these to say these things <laughs> that also happen to just lo heck and love gaming. Yeah. But th those types of people don't really like anime. So they won't go and hate on a popular VTuber because mm. right, right. their interest is gaming, not anime. 
Yeah. If, yeah. if you kind of get what I'm saying. It, it, I feel yeah. like the audiences matter. Because guys are so worried about being like, what the fuck? I didn't do anything. I'm not misogynistic. And so when they, when you, it's hard to have these conversations because a lot of guys feel attacked when they're like, oh, you're, yeah. you're successful because you're a male. And it's like, no, no, that's not what we're saying. It's, it's different. It's, you are more likely to be successful because you are a male because of a number of factors. And, yeah. Yeah. and you can't deny that as a male, you would have advantages in s certain areas. Like mm. that's just how life is. That's how like society has been made. Society. We live Sorry. in a society. We society. Live in a <laughs> that's society. just how it is, right? And to not <laughs> accept that and, and be willing to be like, hey, that's what it is. But fuck it, I can, I can still make shit. I can do my own thing. Like yeah, I, yeah. as long as I'm not a yeah. dick to people, what's wrong with that? Yeah, Nothing yeah. wrong with calling it out and yeah. saying, hey, here's how it is. Yeah. Mm. Did you ever feel like, because there was a point where I feel there was like so much pressure on you that you, like you said, you, it felt like you're in a, like a lose, lose situation, right? Where, you know, the, you know, a lot of the guys were being like, you know, trying to discredit you. You're, if anyone tried to defend you, they were like labeled as a simp or something like that. Mm. And I, I feel like you even got a lot of criticism from like a lot of girls, like being like, oh no, this is, she's representing girls wrong or she's like bringing a bad name for you know, female streamers and stuff like that. I actually feel like that's one of the things I got the least of sometimes. Okay, mm. okay. But really not that often. If anything, the girls were one of the things that kept me going. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that's Cause good. I feel like no one better understands the struggle than other female streamers, mm. than other girls right. that game, than, you know, or really any minority within gaming kind of understands what that what that experience yeah. is right. like. Mm. And the craziest part of all of this and the sim stuff is whatever is like anytime I like pull my Twitch audience or like really get any analytics from that, I have way more female yeah. or like n gender not uh, non binary or any other kind of gendered mm. um, right. statistics than the majority of male streamers. Right, mm. right. right. So. Like make it make sense. Do you remember yeah. how this whole thing started? Like the whole simp movement thing started or was it something that just I think like- it was just like an internet phenomenon. If anything, I, I don't know. I don't want to speculate too much, but I yeah. think maybe at some point uh, people saw like girls doing really well. Mm. Yeah, like they yeah, yeah. Clock that their viewers are guys or that they get right. a certain type of energy. I don't know why, maybe for some people that like it, makes them feel jealous potentially. Right, mm. right. Or to them, it just doesn't really make sense. Mm. Like they don't even want to try to understand it or, you know, whatever. Cause I think, yeah, definitely. I think there was like a, a very, you know, a very long period where it was, it was a very gradual rise of like, oh, girls play games and stream too, yeah. guys. Yeah, it's yeah. like, whoa, <laughs> what the fuck? You know, so it's like, I think it's from there. That's when it started to kind of, this movement of like just people who clearly were never in the right mindset to begin with, who were suddenly like, wow, look at all, look at all these men conforming to these female streamers. What, just because they're good at league? Now they suddenly they're your wife? It's like, no, they're just, they're just entertaining people and yeah. they just want to mm. like watch their favorite streamer regardless of their gender. It's like, Maybe the know. other thing is, um, I think it is really, really hard to break through mm. on Twitch. Yeah, yeah it's absolutely. Just, it's such a saturated platform yeah. and even- yeah. a, three, four years ago when it wasn't a saturated, it was still hard then. Yeah. And it's especially hard when you're the hundred thousandth guy yeah. to stream. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But when you're a girl, because you're like more rare or more of a minority on Twitch, right. sometimes- More rare. rare. Shiny rare. More rare. The they shiny don't, Pokemon. They don't take this. Yeah. I've heard of them. <laughs> They're like the SSR pools <laughs> on Twitch, right? <laughs> because of as many female streamers, yeah. sometimes you can have an easier uh, start only start, not middle yeah, and yeah, growth. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. sometimes you can have an easier time gaining initial traction, mm. again, because you stick out in comparison yeah. to all the other mm. uh, smaller or newer streamers. And I think when they see this like advantage in a sense, I can understand people being upset at that. Like, yeah. I, I, no, I don't have the ability to do right. that. Right. And then they twist it into like, I guess viewing that person's gender negatively mm. or being like, oh, it's just because people are simping for them. Yeah. Like they turned, yeah. I guess, this situation into just calling other people a simp. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, to I, discredit whatever viewership or success that mm, person yeah, has. I, yeah. I'd say you're in the category of just like, just a normal streamer who is a girl, right? Yeah. And I think the 
the what the reason why it's a really fucking annoying conversation to have about all of this stuff is because th- there is a some people who stream on Twitch who happen to be women who definitely push the fucking envelope like <laughs> yeah. just just take the piss with what like should be allowed yeah, yeah. skirt TLS. is it is it yeah is it frustrating when you feel that like you're trying to kind of sh- like push like hey we can do this stuff and then you just flip over to the other category and this woman that's naked yeah. literally slobbering on like yeah. an ear like yeah. how do you how do you how do you deal with that okay i actually had a freaking epiphany regarding this okay right years ago mainly when as mm. i said like there was all this variety yeah. virality around like this girl shows cleavage in games like she's yeah, yeah. schmexual <laughs> yeah yeah she's doing this she's, right? Yeah. And, right no i kid you not but back then like those were almost the only girls that could have like 2K plus viewers. Wow. Aside from right. maybe like Hafu during well, her pro oh, fuck, what was yeah. tournaments. Name, uh, like Casey Tron, was that what it was? <laughs> yeah, she was a meme, but like- Yeah, yeah that's great. Two, yeah, yeah, yeah she's she, fucking hilarious. She's so funny. Yeah. yeah. Um, so that really, those kind of were the top female streamers yeah. mm-hmm. at a very initial point on yeah. Twitch. And at that time, I there was like some frustration, I think for a lot of female streamers, cause they're like, people come into our chats and they either expect this or, you know, they label all female streamers mm-hmm. as this one thing. Right, right, and right, imagine, right. even in college, when I told people that I streamed, they're like, you're a cam girl. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I'm on a webcam, but like, I just didn't necessarily mean I'm a cam girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 even my roommates were like, you do what? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like video game. Yeah. Do, 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 yeah. <laughs> so I, I turn on the computer, I stream online to thousands of viewers and they give me money sometimes. Yeah. I don't yeah. know, why do, they, why do they think I'm a cam girl? I don't know. I that's, know. that's like when you try and explain your streaming career to like your grandma. Yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah. It's, yeah. Like, it's yeah. like the most like rude Cam, entry, your, like your you grandma do doesn't know what a cam girl is. Yeah. You shouldn't know, I hope. <laughs> well, yeah, so initially there were some frustrations where it's like, you know, I God feel like, it, yeah. right? Yeah. But I remember um, someone told me once, they were like, you shouldn't be upset at the female streamers who are doing that. You should be upset at the guys who are expecting you to do the same thing mm. just because they saw someone else do it. Yeah. Or for guys who are having one assumption about an entire gender yeah. based yeah. off of yeah. one yeah. person that they saw. Yeah. And I was like, oh, true. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Third eye opens. <laughs> yeah, <legit>. <laughs> <laughs> because it is difficult not to be frustrated when you feel like there's a negative stereotype yeah. and yeah. not be upset at the people perpetuating that. Mm. Yeah. But also if anything, I'd be more annoyed at like the people click baiting them um, and like trying to sensationalize it. Mm, yeah. Like if homegirl wants to make her money, go make your money. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, especially yeah. nowadays, like you don't have to be mad at all because it's it's been made oh, much yeah. more clear. Yeah. Mm, mm, like yeah. streamers can come in all sorts of types and yeah. varieties. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and that's a really interesting point because I think part of the problem was that talking about the problem just became as profitable as like the pro- problem itself. Yeah. Like there Which was- made it seem like a bigger problem than it, it might yeah, have yeah, yeah, been. Right. Right. Yeah. yeah, like the, the rise of especially Especially commentary and drama YouTubers within like the past five years mm. just like kind of coincided with this kind of witch hunt You're to look triggering for. Triggering my PTSD. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah. That's, yeah, that's just like a similar thought to, I think we spoke about this before on the podcast. It's like, um, you know how uh, sometimes people are like, you know, uh, parents should treat, uh, should teach women how to like avoid fucking creepy, fucking weird dudes. Mm-hmm. And it's like, and I think someone uh, commented something along the lines of like, uh, it was like, uh, no, you should, you, parents should teach their uh, male kids to not be fucking freaks. Yeah, 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 yeah. Which, which is true. Yeah, like, yeah you, like solve the issue from the most fundamental yeah. place and not, yeah, you know, all the way up at the top, yeah. you know? Yeah, I Correct think unfortunately opinion. it's just easier to like pick on like one public target mm. rather than just a lot of faceless masses because then it's just like, well, society, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's, not, there's nothing we can do about it. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. Uh, but, but yeah, you were so right. There was like a period of time where it was especially profitable mm, to yeah. like, pick on people or make videos about them or speak negatively on, on them. Yeah. Like, regardless of what platform they were on, YouTube, mm. Twitch, TikTok, yeah, anything. I remember, like, just, like, every week make there was essays, Pokemon drama. Yeah, like, yeah. Picking people apart. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and for a long time, like I felt really bad about myself because I was like, 
I'm not problematic, man. What's wrong with me? <laughs> you just had a no. You were six, too successful. Your name was worth a lot, and it would yeah. get clicks. That's, yeah. that's such yeah. a compliment, it's, right? But like, <laughs> as one human being, yeah, yeah. knowing yeah, yeah. all these human beings are talking about is weird. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. and it's hard. Um, I, I guess almost like math or like logically, it's hard not to think like, oh, maybe I am the problem. Right. And not to say that I'm a perfect person, but in yeah. hindsight, it just had a lot to do with the position that I was in. Like if yeah. Any, yeah. if you would put any other person and name on the channel that I was on, it would yeah. be their names in those titles instead. Mm. Yeah. Exactly, yeah. exactly. And, and the thing is, because because of like the problem that your name was just so... I guess like recognizable clickable. and clickable. Mm. Like you would do like one thing and I swear like people were just making fucking nine part series on this like one <laughs> thing that was like barely an issue to yeah. begin with. Yeah. And it was just like, and people clicked on it and it's it was unfortunate at the time. I don't know if it still was prevalent nowadays, but there was definitely think, a time. I think it's, I don't think it's as prevalent nowadays because I think now there's a lot of commentary channels who have now opted towards the route of like, we're not gonna necessarily give our opinions on this thing, but yeah. we're just gonna state the facts and yeah. what we know, and it's up to you to decide yeah. what you want to take out of it. Yeah, but yeah. at the same time, I think what a lot of those channels don't understand is that their audiences for the most part aren't as intelligent enough to just make up their own opinions. You know, usually right. they go to those videos because they want, <laughs> they want, their they want the tea, you know, them. they want yeah. the drama. They yeah. want also, an opinion to get behind. Whatever it. you're covering. Yeah. Whose sides are you showing? How much, how deep are you really looking yeah. into? Yeah. Exactly. Are you showing the first report you saw on Dexterra with that shitty fucking articles? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, That's been- Oh yeah, yeah, I was gonna ask. Rest. Yeah, so yeah. so I've recently started getting these. I don't know if this means that I'm doing well. I think that means I'm doing well. Yeah. Uh, I think so. Uh, it's think like, it'll enough. be like Twitch star, Sea Dog fucking hey. took Iron Mask to a park on stream and it was wholesome. Yeah. And then there'll be another one where it's like, Twitch star, fuck, C I, I love the word Twitch star, that's why I call myself. Uh, tw Twitch star, C Dog falls at Jump King, and it's like, that's not news. <laughs> they do this for everything. Really? Okay. Every They'll be like, XQC had an opinion. Here yes. it is. Yeah. No, but sometimes. <laughs> Is it just me, man? Like they write that crazy shit about me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what? What do they write? What do they write? Right, okay, I have this kind of joke that I've made, I think three times, okay, which right. is I have these two cats that I love so much. Oh, um, no. And I care a lot, like I'm so invested in my cat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah, 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 yeah. Um, But sometimes I, you know, my mind goes so far. I'm like, I think my cat should roam free. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Like, you know, it was born an animal. I'm imprisoning it. <laughs> As it has like a two thousand dollar cat tree, a five hundred dollar yeah, cat yeah. bed, I, I think like a high quality tuna three times a day. Yeah. Every I'm cat owner knows it. the cat owns you. Yeah, you do not. Yeah, own yeah, yeah. So yeah. true. The cat yeah. does what it wants. Yeah, so you, you are the cat servant. Yeah. It's, it's living a good Cats life. Cats are man. very good at surviving on their own. <laughs> yeah. It will, it will, it will be fine. Yeah. Yeah. But like, you know, my mind goes this far, and I'm like. You know, it's my dream. I want to live on a farm, but it's enclosed, an enclosed farm, right. so it can roam free. But okay. I never have yeah. to worry about it like going too far. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. how does this lead free range the, cats? The yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Well, yeah. So one day I was making this joke, blah 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 blah, just yeah. like I did to you guys. Mm. Right. What does a Dexterto Dexterto article say? Yep. It says, Pokimane breaks down <laughs> and away no. into a farm or something. I hope, they make a, I hope they make a parody one from this this podcast. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like, I really will hope you do that. Well, and then my mom calls me, she's like, sweetie, are you okay? I'm in the middle of Valorant game like, what, what's wrong? She's like, I read an article. <laughs> I, yeah, I, I don't mind the articles. It's just like, what the fuck? What are these? What are these titles? I don't know. It's yeah. just interesting how they choose to sensationalize the but it's mundane really, it's details. It's really made me realize, like, whether it's YouTube clickbait or random articles online, people yeah. will believe anything they can read. Yeah, yeah. If you read it. Yeah. It's yeah. true. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, it's gone to the point where you're just bombarded with so much shit that you read like one headline and you're like, yeah, okay, no, that, I guess that happened, you know, mm -hmm. and. Just a slow news day. What is, yeah, yeah, not much going, is on. Not much is going on. Especially now with like fucking tweet longers being entire dissertations. You're like, Bruh, I, can't, I can't read through I all can't. this. Just like sometimes- All of a sudden I'm not literate. Yeah, so, yeah like I feel, I feel bad. I feel bad, but sometimes I'm just like, just tell me how to think, it's, right? Yeah. Like I, I don't have the time to get- a, I think it's both like human nature. It's sometimes just easier yeah. to agree with someone when they make sense and it feels good. Yeah. You're like, 
Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Especially when they're passionate but, about it, you're like, you have energy for this. Yeah. I, I don't. I don't. Go ahead. I have energy to agree, which is down here. <laughs> yeah, but the, and also I think we're so, as you said, like overwhelmed with information, mm -hmm. and different titles and comments and this and that, and that. It's hard to tell what is like true or not. Oh, Especially yeah, yeah. when someone is like confident and it sounds like it makes sense, you're like good enough <laughs> yeah. for me. But that's been very difficult in my position. And yeah. it, it sometimes just feels like I have to go so out of my way to correct all the random things other people are saying. No. Yeah. Yeah. That's exhausting. No. Those people are gonna believe whatever they want, right? If, yeah. if you it, if they see this article, they're gonna believe it. And even if the article didn't exist, they're gonna make up shit in their head mm. of why they don't like you. But you know what's sad? I actually kind of disagree. I think there is like, let's say 10 or 20%. Ground. Yeah, mm. I think there's like a group of people. Yeah, they will believe anything negative about you mm. and you cannot convince them out of it because yeah. they didn't convince themselves into it. They yeah, wanted yeah. to hate you from the yeah. start. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I think there is like quite a, like quite a big group of people mm. that might just have gotten the wrong impression or mm, believed right. something that was think it's that big? True. I don't think it's that big. I I, I, I think, think that like- It's, it's hard to truly quantify. You'll go insane but. trying to correct all the false shit about you online. And maybe it's not big, maybe it's not a big deal, mm. but like just trying to correct all the stuff all the time. is like, why do I give a fuck about this? Let me just play video games. I really don't <laughs> fucking care. I think um, like it depends. For mm. example, like nowadays it's not something that bothers me as much. Right, right. Mm. But during a very specific like year or two of my yeah. career, for yeah. sure. That felt like the majority of my life. Like, mm. and I especially no, noticed- No guys, I didn't kick my cat, yeah. <laughs> okay. I noticed because like again, months or like mm. a year or two later, I had a lot of people, like an influx of people mm. that I would see everywhere just saying like, Oh, I'm sorry. Like I had a really bad impression of you because of X, Y, Z. But now I realize you're normal. <laughs> you know? yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. A lot of those kind of comments. So because you get, I think what what can happen is as well, and it's it's nothing like it's not that bad. But you you see all this stuff about you online, and people are saying these things, and you get frustrated about it, and then. The one thing that I've had to like try and dial back personally as well is like try not to give too much frustration uh, often stream or publicly because then it some people see that and they're just like I, I just don't like this energy and yeah they don't like it yeah. and that freaks them out yeah, yeah. and then they'll that get a bad a impression yeah, yeah. yeah. right it. it's yeah. not even about what you say it's about how you say oh yeah yeah, yeah that's what makes it mm. believable or not essentially to people. no definitely yeah well because the way I see about it is that every creator gets like they get like one dunk. They, everyone's allowed one dunk where they could be like, yo, this guy's talking bullshit, right? Yeah. And you, you get you get your slam dunk and like, even if there a are- refresh for like two years. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. on, on cooldown. Yeah, then even if people continue to talk bad about you, if you continue to address it, even if it's a complete slam dunk and you're completely right and the guy's a clown, you're like, you're you're still, people will be like, well, he, he he's kind of like getting a bit too involved in this, right? He's, yeah. getting, he's caring a bit too much He's now. a bit too defensive right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it's a bit sus. Yeah. Too involved in drama, people just think you're sus. Yeah, yeah, yeah even yeah, exactly. if you're it's like, what are you, you hiding? Know, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Why are you yeah. so desperate? <laughs> it's just I don't know. Yeah, yeah. My 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 my, my, le my least favorite thing with like ever coming onto the internet to defend yourself, regardless of how big or small it is, is the argument I've seen it so many times of like, well, that's the price of having fame. Yeah, <laughs> it's like it's like you're, you're you're out there, you put yourself out there, you're mm. famous now, yeah. so you should just be like used to this. And I'm like, yeah, no. No, this should not be normal. You're still a human being. Yeah, you're still yeah, a human yeah, being yeah. at the end of the day. Like yeah. you can say that because you've never been in yeah, these people's yeah. positions, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, we're British though, so it doesn't count. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not people, we're not yeah. people. No, no. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> 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 that was good, all right, <laughs> silence. Better, better, than, better, than, better than some of her, don't I'll take that, I'll take that. Because I think out of the three of us, the only one who's ever had to make an apology video, I think is just Joey. Yeah. And that was for like, like looking Thank back, you. looking back, I'm like, what? This is the most ridiculous reason to make an apology oh, it was video whack of as all fuck. time. What? Yeah, it was whack as fuck. So it was when, um, do you know the anime Yuri on Ice? <laughs> I've heard of it. You know, the ice skating one? Yeah. yeah. So there was a, a massive, obviously because uh, of the of the subject matter of the show and how it kind of, you know, plays out, it has a very massive female audience, right? Yeah. Even though it is technically a sports 
manga or anime. Yeah. So I oh, made this sports, I made this one joke <laughs> where I said like, no, 99% of the people who watch this show watch it for the boy on boy action. Yeah. And 1% of them watch it for the actual sport. Yeah. And uh, yeah, and it, and, it, and it Twitter went off. <laughs> they went off on me. And obviously this is the first time where I think because of where I was, where my channel was at the time. Yeah. Uh, it, I had never really gotten that much backlash before because I've been yeah. saying my opinion for years now, yeah. you know, a lot of hot takes, but at the end of the day, it's whatever, you know, it's just an opinion of mine. But I think I really <laughs> underestimated <laughs> how far an opinion can go about a show, especially with a dedicated fan base. So yeah. I just woke up one morning to just like countless I mean, comments. I, I get tweets. pissed off hearing you talk about shows. Cause, yeah. cause I think it's cause like, I think the way you talk about shows sometimes yeah. is like dismissive and it yeah. makes people feel like, why won't you fucking give it a chance? <laughs> no, jerk. but here's the yeah. thing with wow. the you're a nice thing. Yeah. I watched the entire show, yeah, yeah, yeah. right? And I enjoyed, yeah. Some parts of it. I didn't yeah. think it was the most amazing show yeah. in the world. Yeah. But I thought some parts of it did but, pretty yeah, well. You but said yeah. you didn't like it. So then they yeah. were like, right. okay, you didn't so, like it. Yeah. And, then- yeah. and and because it is basically, you know, a show that is targeted towards a certain demographic in a yeah. lot of ways, yeah. immediately people were like, he's a misogynist. It's like he he he's he's homophobic, he's misogynist, he just doesn't like things that we women what enjoy. So my apology was Is just it based- still up or you take it down? Oh no, I took it down. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I took it down, but like, uh, you know, in hindsight that was, it was completely unnecessary yeah. because I think that's the moment I uploaded it. And then I realized when I read the comments to that apology video, like 90% of them were like, dude, you didn't have to apologize. Yeah, well, the first yeah. time, the first time you, you get like a, I guess a, a bunch of hate mm. overnight in one go is probably the, the scariest. Yeah. And, yeah. Yeah. and, and for with. me, that was the first time where yeah, like, yeah. I just woke up and it was just like all these new people who were just like giving me shit and just calling me names. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah. Fuck! This is yeah. this is the end of my career. I'm I'm fucked. Yeah. Right. So you feel very pressured. To- oh yeah, 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 yeah. absolutely. Yeah. So I took action, and then immediately after I uploaded that video, and I started to see the first wave of comments of, "Dude, it's fine. You didn't have to apologize for that." Yeah. Immediately took it down, and I realized that was a big mistake. I shouldn't have apologized for <laughs> yeah. that. So now I know if I say an opinion, I don't give a shit. Yeah. <laughs> I just like looking back. I just I just find it funny, like especially mm. with how many people have made apology videos. Yeah. <laughs> now it's just like you, you you look at the you look at the list and you're just like, oh, what did you apologize for? Oh, you know, I ran like a CS:GO gambling scam. Yeah. Oh, you know, I I, 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 I said I said like I came on my cat. Oh, what did you apologize yeah. for? Oh, you know, I, I shit it on Yuri on Ice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, legit. I was like, so what did you say? Yeah, 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 yeah. So like, but but you know, again, like at that time, I had no idea, right? Right? And yeah. because again, I think I was just like pressured into thinking, oh, maybe I'm the bad guy because mm-hmm. of this mass audience of people online yeah. who were saying how shit I was as a person for giving this opinion. Yeah. So I think, well, I mean, obviously now I know because I've experienced that and I've obviously heard from other people's experiences and whatnot, but I think initially, yeah, it was- uh, It means people are engaging was, with your yeah. opinion. No, which absolutely. Which is good because sometimes think, that means they're getting angry, no. but at least they're engaging. That's no, all that matters. Exactly. And I think Hi, now- I'm a YouTube partner manager. <laughs> 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 We've seen like an uptick in yeah, yeah, whatever yeah. you did in that video, yeah. let's keep yeah, it coming. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Just say the worst things imaginable. Okay. To be honest, right? Like mm-hmm. you had to make an apology video, but wouldn't it be even worse if nobody gave a fuck about what you said? I'm just- <laughs> well, no, no. Well, I, I mean, I guess if you had to pick true. the True, that is true. I, and, I, I, so, I like are you funny. saying it's just the curse of being yeah. popular, yeah. Connor? Is that what you're saying? Oh, if you have opinions That's on what stuff. comes with fame. Yeah, if you yeah, have yeah. opinions on stuff. So, I, I said, I don't like some anime. People get really annoyed about it, but it's like, yeah. you're wrong. So <laughs> that's not I, my I mean, fault. <laughs> an, an opinion on an anime, I think is a, you know, that's like a subject. People are very passionate. You'd think so, right? You'd think well, so. Well, you tell us later about your anime opinions, we'll, we'll get angry. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, I actually think this whole thing is such an interesting premise. Like talking about apology videos mm. and whether or not you regret them. Have you made yeah. one? Oh, I've made. Wait, what did <laughs> <that? laughs> what you make? How, how, many, how many apologies have you made? You know how crazy my life is? I made yeah. an apology video where I apologize. I apologize about like four things. Okay, right. Wait, all what, at once. wait, when was this? <laughs> um, This was like at the peak of like all the videos mm, and mm, all the everything mm, yeah. way before the pandemic and Among Us. Actually, not before, maybe it was right at the beginning. Right, right. Um, And there are some things that I apologize for that I absolutely stick by. Mm. Yeah. So, so what happened? Can, can, I, can you tell? Uh, so I don't remember any of this. I, don't I was too busy watching. If, if you don't remember, it's fine. That just means it was. It wasn't important. <laughs> it wasn't important. No, 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 I remember. It's just like, how do I summarize? Yeah, yeah. yeah. TLDR. Well, what what do you guys know 
I guess. It's I know people were angry at you, but I never understood why. I remember, yeah, I, was kind I, remember, of confused. I, remember, I remember like different Leafy, time zone and like, stuff. Leafy made yeah, nine so videos in was, a row about you or some shit. That, yeah, 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 yeah. Leafy made a lot of videos about right, me. Right. Yeah. I guess the issues with a, a lot of the things that people are mad at me about is it gets taken out of context so far mm, and then yeah. snowballed into one tidbit and then. Like that's the G- thing that sticks pushed. with people. Yeah. Like, yeah. This is why I hate her because of this. Yeah. But like, you don't know the context regarding that thing whatsoever. Yeah. Which is probably like one of the things that, not to retract the apology, <laughs> but like in hindsight, I don't know if it made as much sense yeah. to apologize, apologize about this one thing. Yeah, so yeah, I'll yeah, tell yeah. you guys about it. Yeah. There was this guy who, when those kind of videos were popular, also made a video about me, um, like, legit just shitting on me like that's it yeah. Yeah, but yeah. actually the thing is like i was used to people shitting on me at that point mm. what really pissed me off about his video which i was what which i didn't watch the whole thing but i was watching through some of it on stream oh that's always a bad move i know always a bad, bad call bad call <laughs> but i was new yeah no oh, I, only seven years I was yeah, new. Yeah, 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 yeah. it's tough okay, because okay. like initially it's like i would ignore all of this and mm. then i realized like you need to respond in order to give people something to respond oh, with, yeah, if that yeah, makes yeah, sense. Yeah, yeah. And then trying to find that middle ground of like, don't give everything attention, but yeah. give the right amount of attention at the right time to the mm, right, yeah. it's, yeah, it's yeah. hard. Well, you have a right to defend yourself. Yeah, yeah. 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 so uh, when someone had linked me this and I was like skimming through it, I saw that he was pulling up like random people's images mm, that had mm. photos with me at like meet and greets or mm, in their yeah. icons or whatever. Yeah. And then he was speaking negatively about how they look in his video oh, as yikes. he's a VTuber, by the way. Like he's not showing his face. Right. Shitting on my fans for how they look. Yeah. So again, it was like a, a guy talking about me and mm. it's like, you know, you can say whatever about me. It's right. not gonna be the first time that I hear it. Yep. Yep. But for you to pull up photos of fans of mine mm. and then for some reason be talking about how they look in front of your whole audience. Mm. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. yeah and. Like, you know, I do put myself out there, so maybe you can justify talking about me, right? right? But these people, and I know, like, if you're not a public figure, that type of scrutiny yeah. on a wide scale, like, you just don't know how that might impact. Oh, yeah, 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 it fucks with you. Exactly. So I was just like, this is so wrong beyond belief. And obviously, mm. like, I was very passionate in that mm. moment. Yeah. Um, and then I was like scrolling through the video and I saw that like the video was sponsored. And I basically made a comment about like, I cannot possibly understand why a sponsor mm. would watch a video, not about someone talking about me. You know, there's yeah. plenty yeah, yeah. of those. Mm. And obviously like um, commentary type of videos yeah. deserve to be sponsored, obviously, mm. right? Yeah. But I was wondering, like, did they really watch through this and see him shit on someone for how they look or like how much they yeah. weigh or like yeah. whatever it is? Mm. And they thought that like this was good content to like enable in a sense. Because right, when you right. sponsor something, like, you know, you're promoting that type of content. Yeah. yeah. Well, a lot of the brands don't give a single fuck though. Yeah. They're just like, I want to be on anything that gets us a million views. I, I don't I can Maybe, care less. Maybe, right? Did, yeah. I can't remember. Did you end up, did you? take the video down initially? I can't remember. No. no, no, no okay, I, I can't remember, I was trying to remember. Oh yeah, no, 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 no. Um, it was just because you said the sponsor comment. Yes, yeah. I've never taken a video down of someone talking about me, oh, ever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. I took a video down once of someone who screenshotted my tweets without saying anything, because I was like, oh, I just don't, I deleted mm. the tweets, I so I don't want yeah, to yeah, yeah, out yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. And then people were like, she takes down videos of people talking about it. I've never in my life done that, because I recognize, yeah. especially as a content creator, like someone puts effort into something and puts yeah. it out there, you have no right or you yeah. have no yeah. rights over that. It's, yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. one thing the internet is very sensitive over. You can't take down people's stuff. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. exactly. Yeah. Um, so anyways, I had just made that comment on stream where I was like, I can't understand from a business perspective mm. why you would want your name on content like that. Mm. And Fair then enough. I said like, I would never work with that company. Yeah. Right. But then people spun that into me trying to take this guy's sponsor from him. Mm. Right, right, right. Which I understand, especially because I think the uh, commentary community, rightfully so, is like a little, uh, like a little bit concerned about that stuff because their videos yeah. get demonetized easily. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. So I, I understand the concern, mm, yeah. but I feel like it was a little bit out of context because oh, my yeah. issue yeah. was really just with what he was I, doing. I think if it happened now, fans. if you had had the same thing had happened now with the same public sentiment now, I don't think it would it would have turned out that way. Exactly, it was they, that's they what's didn't. crazy to me. Because because like I I think hearing from your perspective, like what's frustrating about the situation is that 
I, I think you had a very genuine point where, you know, if you're gonna if you're gonna dunk on like Pokimane or whatever, then just leave people, mm. leave your fa- leave her fans out of it who yeah. have like no, who have nothing to do with the online internet lifestyle yeah. or anything mm. like that. Yeah, you're saying that like you wouldn't take the response. I'd be like, yeah, fucking take yeah, it off, yeah. dude. I'd be like, fuck him. Yeah, dude, what's he? This guy's an asshole. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, and it it seems unfortunate that because you made that statement afterwards, it almost seemed like it discredited everything you said before, which was yeah. like a genuine point. Because mm. you know, I I I I can see what how you know how people can see it in a way where you it seemed like you were trying to take this guy's sponsor uh, because it was in the heat of the moment everything like that but that doesn't really discredit everything that you said before about the Uh, video about it not yeah yeah yeah. so Mm -hmm. i was basically just like i understand and like i apologize because i would never want to impact someone else's livelihood for sure and i still stand by that like i wouldn't want Mm -hmm. to yeah but I also stand by the fact that I disagree with what he was doing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And I, I don't think that is okay. Well, it seemed like at that point, it got to a point where, did you even know what you needed to apologize for? Cause it seemed <laughs> like, like, like genuinely, cause it, it seemed like at that time, I was just like, I don't even know why people are mad at Pokimane mm. at this point. It just seems like people are looking for anything to be bad yeah, at Just something Pokemane. to do. Like, you know. <laughs> fun thing to yeah. do. It's like, man, I'm bored today. What should we do? I wish yeah, we yeah. shit on Pokimane. Yeah. It's like, why? <laughs> Dude, I'm so glad for the last like two years with like mm. Among Us and it being more mainstream and yeah, having like yeah. younger and more female fans. Like, mm-hmm. I feel like, uh, more of a human being. Yeah. <laughs> like I'm treated a little more fairly because mm. I feel like now there's a stronger group of people who are willing to like stand up for my mm. side of things. Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm less so like an anomaly per se. Like yeah. this, this I felt very objectified during that time mm. in the sense that um, people were speaking of me as if I wasn't a real person. Right. Um, but now I feel like there are people who like relate to me enough. And obviously I've continued to make content. So you yeah. need to build fans over a long period of time. All well, thanks to so, Among Us. Yeah. Uh, pardon? All well, thanks to Among <laughs> Us. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing makes me feel just, more human just, than when I'm playing said, Among Us yeah, with my how, friends. Just how you said, thanks to Among Us, I now have my life back. And, I, and it's I just like to like, thank <laughs> Among Us. Okay, let me look through <laughs> Among no, Us has changed the, the game for, for women. Thanks the influx of a more diverse audience. For nothing has done more for women than yeah. Among Us. <laughs> like, it had I nothing mean, else has done. Yeah. A lot of good. Yeah. Trace back to really? Yeah. Really? yeah. Really? Society was never yeah. the same when <laughs> Among Us came out. <laughs> Think about it. Though. We're all just like back. We're all back in like fucking yeah. Rome, having gladiator fights. Among yeah. Us, all civilized space. No, Flying cars. Flying yeah. cars. <laughs> what's, like, what's done more for feminism? The suffragettes. Or among us, you know? <laughs> women actually- Well, personally. Yeah, because think about it. Because <laughs> women women actually got the right to vote. In a yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Their voices were finally heard. <laughs> Every vote matters. And Every. right off the creation of the game. We didn't have to wait a few patches. That's we always, right. 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 always from day one. Huh? Day one. From day one, we could vote in among us. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I do, I do find it so funny. Like I've talked to a few streamers now, and everyone talks about this Among Us period. Like, yeah, like it's it's like, like it's like a unicorn. Like, it's like everyone spotted Bigfoot. Like yeah. everyone talks about Among Us. Like it was crazy. The golden age of I Twitch. I mean, Fortnite too. Fortnite was the first crazy. Really? And Among Us was the second crazy. Yeah. What's the next crazy gonna be? Yeah. I don't think. Not Valorant. I fucking hate Valorant so much. I don't think much. there will be one for a really long time. <sighs> oh. oh, thank you. Oh, I, you're right. Yeah, I, yeah, I despise I that everyone plays Valorant so much. Why? I feel like it's the most boring game I've ever played in my life. <laughs> Paying fifty dollars for a fucking skin. I know you're scared. It's because I'm bad. Okay, that's you, why I'm bad at the game. Okay, if you can't beat them. <laughs> <laughs> also, I, I, I well, let's play. <sighs> I'll make sure you have a great time. You see, I, I will have like, if, when I'm, if I do when we're back in Japan, I'll have like 200 ping and you'll have to be, it's fine. It's playable. I'll just no, be even yeah. shit up. <laughs> well, then this when dude I, plays Valorant on 200 ping. I wonder why you hate it. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah played on the Japanese servers and he still sucks. So well, no, everyone's insane on the Japanese. I, can I, I would go yeah. in the new rookie lobby and it would be a 10 year old boy who's just tried Valorant for the first Cracked. time. And then he's yeah. like, oh yeah, this is easy. Boom, 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 boom. Just shoots everyone hit the wall. And I'm like- No, you have to play while you're here. 
Okay, okay. And you'll have fun. Like, actually, like a five stack, it's hard not to have fun when you can talk to your friends. And I think I'm just envious. I, I, I'm like the boy looking outside in the window with everyone else having fun. And I'm like, oh, I'm on the Japanese side. Like <laughs> Why can't I? I hate you all for having fun without me. Actually, that makes a lot of sense. That's yeah. probably why. That's yeah. why I have, yeah. uh, I've actually been the word Valorant from my chat because I don't want people asking me about playing it because I'm, I'm, I have like trauma because I'm like, I don't want to play <laughs> Just stream it here, enjoy yeah. it, and then just let it go. You know, just be like that's when you're in go. Japan, just if you love it, let hey, it, yeah, go. Yeah, just let it go. I'll try. I'm willing to try again if I played with people. I'm willing to try again on 200 MS. I'm down to try. <laughs> actually, on America, it's like 110, which is actually way more playable than 200. Yeah. I feel like 150 is the cutoff of when it becomes no, unplayable. Really, it is. I've also played League on like 100 ping, right? but 200, yeah. you just you can't. <laughs> That's too much. It just yeah. sounds like you're like trying to get him into a new drug. It's like, it's, yeah. it's, it's not the drug that was bad. You just uh, didn't uh, do it with the right people. I'm, yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm really against <laughs> it. I, yeah. I, I think all Riot games are a drug, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Except for uh, like, League, of, League of Runeterra. I mean, that's just like- Legends of Runeterra. <laughs> that one's that like person. cough syrup. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you really need to, but not all it's like last resort. It's like, yeah, it's like the medicine yeah. You, yeah. your mum forces you to take. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, oh, okay, here you go. There's yeah. good lore in it, I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I, yeah, I maybe I want to play it. I just, yeah. ah, fuck. I also just think that there's that awkward moment when you die in the game and then you're like, I can't wait to play the next round in five minutes. But at least it's and not that long. Sometimes it's it feels long. And then you buy shit and you're oh, like, so I spent all my money. Earlier yeah, it depends on okay. you get killed. I, yeah. I am very impatient. I am the asshole who always runs first and then I die and then I get angry because why am I impatient? It's my fault. I suck at this game. That's why you love Apex, right? Yeah, just constantly moving. Yeah, I love Apex. Actually, that makes sense. Yeah. yeah. And Apex is your game, Valorant. Just and also play Apex it. is so big in Japan as well. And really? like all the VTubers and all the Japanese streamers fucking love it. Wait, that's so cool. Yeah, so it's fun. It's fun. You but know, then it's, like, it's kind of died off a little bit. In NA, or I guess like on Twitch in general, I feel like there's just no meta right now. Yeah. No really yeah, I was about yeah. to ask you, like, what do you think the next meta is going to be on Twitch? What do I think the next meta is going to be on Twitch? Well, let me tell you. Meta. I think it's in an odd way IRL for a little bit. Okay. Yes, and in general, like traffic on Twitch a little bit. Mm, right. I think there's not gonna be like a huge game for a while. There's not gonna be another Fortnite or Among Us. Yeah. Maybe for years yeah, or yeah. ever again. Mm. Honestly, the, the only next thing I can think of is like, among some us too. <laughs> I, 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 some I, crazy like VR thing or like a- oh. uh, Among Us VR. To, <laughs> Among Us VR is That's coming already out. That's already been around. That's been around. Among Us skins in Fortnite <laughs> yeah, is the next yeah. meta. No, even then it has to be innovative. The reason Fortnite was innovative was because it was the first game to go mainstream. Mm. The reason Among Us was like innovative in a way the was because- The first game to go mainstream? I don't think it was the first. <laughs> There's been games that go mainstream before Fortnite, right? There was nothing on the level of like Fortnite. When you have celebrities- Minecraft? Sports- But, it, but it's not, it's not- um, Yeah. Really? Or yes. it, not Minecraft even, is like- uh, Not even COD? It's like a staple in the game. I guess it's kind of a slow right. burn as well. Yes, I kind of got there. Fortnite was a massive trend that went mainstream. And that right. had That's like never okay. been seen before within gaming. There's been large games, obviously, right, right, yeah, but yeah, it's yeah. always within gaming. Like if you're not a gamer, that you don't really sense. know okay. about That's it. Fine. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you just don't know about it. Right. Yeah. Um, but that with like celebrities playing it, like yeah, Drake, NFL right, players, yeah. Yeah. Tr Drake playing it, it went, Huge, right? Among Us was the other big boom, but it was because of such a specific set of circumstances. Yeah, yeah. The pandemic, mm. on top of it being one of the first fun games that had a really large player pool. Mm. So mm. like a whole new level of collaboration, right? Oh yeah. Mm. With, honestly, on Twitch, sometimes it feels like been there, done that with everything. Yeah. So right. when is the next time there's gonna be like something really new and innovative? It's hard to tell. I feel like there might have to be some sort of like tech innovation. Uh, that right. that I, I was I was like really uh, against like the thought of doing IRL stuff. I thought this fucking it's weird. It's going outside, and then I and then I did it once because um I did uh I they gave me a backpack uh so I could do the thing where I'd like take uh, Iron Mouse around. Mm -hmm. and I was like, okay, actually this is kind of fun. Yeah, but, like what if right? like. What if like I did this and did like something where I just got drunk or something? I don't fucking yeah. know. I think, I think, and then it was really fun. And right? then now I'm like, okay, I yeah. think I, they're my favorite streams. I think to though, do. definitely in the beginning they when IRL so was good. becoming a thing, it didn't necessarily have like the best reputation. Well, well, yeah, the people yeah. who were doing it, like a lot of the early people, were doing some really fucking weird. Yeah, stuff. like the yeah, like the yeah. like the Ice Poseidon era was. Oh definitely, uh, god, <laughs> questionable yeah. at best. You know. Extremely. Yeah. Yeah. So but I think just because of of, of that, it's been cleaned I think up a lot. when yeah when you hear the word IRL immediately. 
immediately it's like you think of people like that as like oh shit i don't want to yeah. get anywhere near that but exactly. obviously you know now it's like you know you have people like jake and bake and like people yeah. who actually push yeah. the boundaries of irl in like a, a positive really direction fun. yeah and like yeah. a fun yeah. direction obviously so yeah, yeah. the if barrier of entry guys, needs to come down if i lived in japan oh my god my irl streams would never end <laughs> oh, i started doing more I, yeah. but, yeah. but I, yeah. I always want to do something interesting i'm just like i don't want to just fucking walk around go to an arcade no i've been doing yeah that. yeah the best yeah go I'm to a convenience that. store for six hours on no. an easy stream. Honestly, no, it, like, some, it, some it, it, be like, I don't want I to. Would never. It's too easy yeah. content. You're gonna, do, you're gonna have such a fun time. Cause like, I forget. Your viewership through the roof. Well, the thing is, I'm sorry, Pokemon. Yeah. Yeah. My uh, content is higher than that, okay? Uh, I have higher standards. Uh, yeah. I'm just, I'm kidding, I'm no, 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 listen. Him trying to like really plan content. This needs to be perfect. I, I don't plan it. I, I just Twitch viewers. I can love convenience stores. <laughs> I can love them. Like that's it. I think that's the difference between being a YouTuber and being a Twitch streamer, right? Because mm -hmm. like when I stream, I'm like, I need to know what I'm doing. This needs to be planned. I need a structure. It needs a narrative. Yeah, of yeah, some yeah, yeah, yeah. Kind. What's yeah. the YouTube title? Yeah. What is the YouTube Wait, title? Okay, honestly. The worst thing for a Twitch stream is a narrative or a story. <laughs> no, no, it's no, I'm, I, okay, I'm against, I'm against you there. For repeated ones, yeah. Unless it's like an event or something that mm. you specifically announce. Yeah, right. The reason YouTube and live streaming is so different and what wow. works best for live streaming is you want it to be a form of content that people can tune in at any point and it's enjoyable. I, I agree. That's yes. why, like, I think even like a challenge. Yeah. Like when I've I've been offered to do like cooking streams where it's yeah, like this right. person against this person. I hate that stuff. Yeah. Because yeah. someone has to watch from the beginning, middle, and end, mm. yeah. and that's just not how live streaming is. Uh, that's how a video is. Well, well, oh man, I kind of disagree in some aspects there. I yeah. I'm I'm so in the camp of because uh, I only really started streaming uh, like two years ago, uh, but it's been going really well. It's been doing well, and um, my whole thought process around it is like make the live stream obviously as entertaining as possible, but built around the whole thing so that it can fit nicely. It's like a 15 minute YouTube video. That is literally how I plan all my streams. Okay. And I find that improves personally, it like improved my streams. Cause I'm trying to hit those beats. What I'm trying to think, hit those moments. Or I guess like, um, how do you think that disagrees with my point? Or how do oh. you try to make it into a 15 minute video? So do you mean like intro, outro? I guess Cause I, I agree those things are good. Yeah, I guess just having a basic goal to work towards. Yeah, yeah, like, like there is I a I think narrative. goals are great. Yeah, yeah. Like one general goal because yeah. like, Whenever someone does enter the stream, mm. like I yeah. think that's kind of in agreement, if anything, because whenever oh, okay. someone okay. enters the okay. stream, they're yeah. like, oh, you're trying to make $5,000 on GTA and you're this far yeah. across. Yeah. And it's easy to jump in mm. and yeah. watch. I guess yeah. I mean like more- Oh, if more it was like completely oh, lost okay. if you don't have the start. Exactly. Okay. Like a movie, you can't jump into the middle. Right. Yeah, like yeah. It, it doesn't feel as well. It would yeah. have to be something that can be explained in the title. That's yeah. my way of doing yes. it as well. I think so, that's really good. Because it's also the same with YouTube, right? I got to hook them and it has yeah. to fit in the thumbnail and a title. Yeah. So that's kind of the way I plan out most of my things. But Dude, sometimes, that, yeah. I think that's like, <laughs> that's third eye opening what? of content creation. No, in a good way. When you're a Twitch streamer yeah. and you think about how to make a Twitch stream, a YouTube video before making this, like you have oh, the yeah. thumbnail yeah. title yeah. Mine, and then you make the content and then it's a full stream and then it's a video. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. That's, like, it's, it's, it's the full circle. Yeah. The roof. Yeah. 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 Well, cause, cause like- You I've feel been, like I, a goddamn God. Yeah, cause I've been, trying, <laughs> I've been trying to do that as well recently. And I'm, I'm not a Twitch streamer at all, but I've like been dabbling in Twitch streams and I noticed, the best streams that I do is something that has, that the audience can follow, that has like a specific mm -hmm. goal or an end yeah, game. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and I think that's good because it's good for viewer attention. Yeah, like, yeah, oh, yeah. I want to watch this goal finish. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Oh, yeah, as long as it's an achievable goal. I did um, I did like the Jump King stuff and I love oh, Jump King. I know, but I Jump did, King is so hard. I did uh, one of the fan made mods that like Ludwig did and Miskiff did that took them like 40 hours and I was like, I'm better than them. I'll I'll do it. And uh, yeah, it took me like 40 minutes more than Ludwig, and I was like, I'm never I fucking. Beat it. Yeah, and it was it was like eight streams, oh, and it was just like, for the viewers by like stream six, <laughs> were like, can you just. Can you stop? Yeah. Can, we, can we do can something, do else? something can you, else? Can you fucking stop? Please dad, you haven't fed us in eight yeah. days. And it's yeah. so sad. It's like, that is eight streams that I did to make one YouTube video. That's one YouTube video, that's but it's such a fucking painful. good YouTube video. Cause it's like, oh, it's like, you good. see the journey, you get like the multiple days Aww. and it's like a whole thing. It's good, but it's You're too much. You're starving during yeah. it. And I'm like- Have you played Getting Over It? I think that's a great I've done. Game. I did that in three hours. Yeah. He's, he's done all the rage games. Yeah, he he went did. through a phase. Oh, so it was an addiction. Well, it was an addiction. Here's my here's my thing, and uh, obviously because I 
I started doing this and I realized the whole YouTube thing. And I knew, I noticed that like Ludwig was doing it really well. And I was messaging Ludwig and I'm like, hey, how do you make your streams? And he told me the same thing. And I was like, okay. So I kind of like, just, I'm like, oh my God, Ludwig's just doing this, but better. Yeah. And I'm like, I'm just gonna copy Ludwig. So I started, um, I started doing all the, I also wanted to beat him in things. So Ooh. I started doing the same thing, the same games that he was doing. And I did Pogo Stark. Have you played this game? It's fucking horrible. Jump King is like nothing compared to this game. It is no. miserable. I can do getting over it. I can't do Jump King. I love Jump King so I can much. Do a stream or two. If I can't finish it within a s two streams, I'm you pissed like off. It. Okay, right. okay. Well, jump King, you can beat in two streams. I, I, I beat, I beat Jump <laughs> Hell no. I, be, I beat Jump King in three. Well, they're like eight hour streams. Okay, that's impressive. Yeah. I've played Jump King. How by long the for? Way. How long? Like maybe three hours, two or three that's times. Not, that's nothing. That's not. Okay. I know. You, but it's like, good. You got to. You got to get in there for the long haul. I can't. I will. <laughs> yeah, so I, I, the one challenge where, that he did that I was like, I'm not fucking doing this is I beat Pogo Stuck, the first one. Mm -hmm. And that's like the easiest of the three. Mm -hmm. And it took me 30 hours, which is less than all the other ones. But I was like, this was such a miserable experience that I'm like, I'm just not doing the other ones. Fuck, like, yeah, fuck like off, you could finish a JRPG you can, you, in that time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I'm yeah. like, you can, you can mock me louder. You can hold it against me. Fuck off, I'm not doing <laughs> this. Like, this is too fucking, you're just, cause he did it when he was a small streamer and it didn't matter if he had no concurrent viewers or something. I'm like, oh, I will- Oh, why does your viewership do this? It's yeah, cause yeah, they're like, yeah. oh, what's he doing today? I can't wait to see. Um, not again. <laughs> it's like, no. So then now I'm trying to focus more on stuff that could be done in two or yeah. one. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's really fun. Yeah. And like, yeah. For people to jump in and watch. Yeah, I think that's that's the strat. Make a stream so that if they if they miss it, they can watch the VOD. If they if they want to watch the highlight, they can do it. But they can just come next to, to the next day and it'll be something completely new. A good time. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Um I feel like maybe the next meta will be something like Pokemon Go. No. Really? No, a mix why? of IRL no. and something. Okay. Not okay. IRL and something. So not Pokemon you, Go, but maybe something else. Yes. Okay. So you think IRL will play a big part? I in think whatever so. Next as well. I think so. I, yes. Because I don't know. Like I, I've done like one IRL stream after like dissing IRL streamers for like yeah. the longest time, and I'm like, damn, it's like really fun. I can yeah. see why people yeah. do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cause yeah, I mean, all like, all you do is just do what you normally you do. Be yeah. Human. Yeah, you yeah. be a human, it's right? It's a whole new way of streaming. Like it's a new experience for the streamer and a new experience. Oh, yeah. For yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I, I thought for sure the first time I did it, I thought I would immediately hate it. Yeah. Just because again, like yeah. I had that like connotation about IRL. Yeah. yeah, I did it once and I'm like, yeah, I want to do it again. But, yeah, but yeah, it's, yeah. it's good for the like, you do it once or tw like two, three times a month. I could not yeah. do it every day. No, yeah. no you, you can't do it every day. The people, the people yeah. who do it every day, I'm like, how the fuck do you do you like enjoy yeah. life? Yeah. How do you find enough things to do every day? You don't. They don't. Yeah, they, yeah, yeah. Sometimes if they just. If you sit. live in Japan, you probably could. Well, but like, I, I, mean, look, at, I, look, at, I look at people like Rob CD, who yeah. literally does an IRL stream like every day. Yeah. It's like Jake. Yeah. And I'm just and, and Jake back in the day, right when yeah. he was in Japan, I'm like, how do you? How, built how different, you, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. Built different. I, I, yeah, yeah. yeah it's I, crazy. I like my privacy too. Much. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, I like uh, enjoying my food in restaurants. Yeah. And I like having a good time. I would start forgetting, like, am I streaming or not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just yeah, yeah. Around exactly. Stuff. I'd get confused. Yeah. yeah. Well, I'm like, sometimes I'm like, oh, okay, I've, I've touched a bit too much grass recently. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I need to go back, back into my den. I, I need to go back to my fucking cave, become yeah. a hermit yeah, for a bit. I do get like that too. It's nice. You get used to it. Yeah, it is. Yeah. But like, I guess going to something a bit more positive than everything we've been talking about, you've just been to Korea recently. Yes. How was that? Amazing. Was that your first time? Yeah. Oh, your first time in Korea? Yeah. I've never been. Uh, me neither, I've never been. Shame I've, I've been an once. hour away. You should go. Well, we've yeah. never been, and yet it's like an hour and a half flight. Well, because getting back into Japan is such a pain that yeah. it's really? like if you're going to leave, it better be for something big. Uh, yeah, no, for yeah. me, like even, it was even like before the pandemic. For me, oh. it was like, oh, it's yeah, just there. You go? I can go yeah. wherever I want. And then you never go. And then I just haven't been yet. <laughs> you guys should for sure plan like two weeks to go. Did, did you go for content or for a vacation? And then you're like, I can also make content. No, I went to stream. Oh, okay. okay, yeah. okay. Mm. Because I had such a great time. I did this Paris trip a couple of years back with Jake and we yeah. streamed there. Mm. Right. And I was like, that was so much heckin' fun. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Now that we're past COVID, well not past COVID days, but at least we can travel more now. Mm. Yeah. I just immediately wanted to plan something cool. And Korea was like the perfect thing. Yeah, right. I even got to a point, I was there for about 10 days and I got to a point where I was like, I'm having so much fun, should I extend my trip? Yeah. And then I just kept finding out about other things to do in Korea. I'm like, I could extend my trip for three more weeks. Just come back again another time. Yeah, I'll just yeah, come yeah. back. Yeah. But it is just an A plus of a place to visit. Oh, what was yeah. your favorite thing to do there? 
Is this supposed to be a hot take? Or? Yeah. I'm about to sound like an LA girl, but like the shopping there was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> it was. No, it was, it really the was. it was the filtered water, right? Yeah. It was the filtered water. Yeah. Filtered water too. Well, they, they, they have like the best skincare stuff in the world. Yes. Right? Yeah. yeah. Like you go to Korea and you come back looking prettier. <laughs> the clothes, the yeah. makeup, the fried the chicken water. is so yeah. good. Yeah. No, I mean- The plastic surgery. Yeah. None of that, yeah. but you still look prettier. Yeah, yeah. Um, well, like, yeah. <laughs> I remember me and Jake, I did a 12 hour stream one day. Oh my God. I How did you have a yeah. battery that lasts like, that long? He had more than one. Oh, okay. genius. And he had like eight hours of that was shopping. And that was some of the highest viewership we had the whole trip. What? Why? People were like, oh, you're going to a temple. You're cooking with a professional Korean chef. Mm. Cool, 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 cool. You're shopping for 12 hours. <laughs> Real shit. That, that, was, shit. that was the most views? Well, it was like 30 to 35,000. Like just- What? No, but the thing is it was growing the longer we shopped and I was- having the time of my life. Were you Damn. buying anything? Oh. Or were you just like window shopping? I was buying hellish. <laughs> oh. I don't know what I'm doing for my next IRL stream. <laughs> Dude, buying shit on IRL streams is so f annoying though. Cause you have the backpack. No, and then but that's like, why having a like buddy picking. is great. Uh, yeah. I go pay, he's hiding. No credit card leaks, no nothing. Yeah. It was <laughs> amazing. Cause like, you know, I love to shop. Now I'm like doing my job while shopping. And other you're, people you're are You're getting paid it? to shop? Yeah. You're literally yeah. making money as you spend. It was yeah, a yeah. new high. <laughs> <laughs> Drugs, okay, cool. But have you ever shopped while 30,000 people are watching? <laughs> and that's your job? <laughs> Be like, yo, can I get some gift subs to buy this nice yeah. shirt? You oh, know? Actually, the best part of Korea was the fans. I've never experienced uh, uh. such amazing, like, all the fans were amazing. And yeah. <laughs> like the majority of them were girls. Oh, the so majority. Yeah. Okay. And they always come with a gift. Thank you. <laughs> so nice. This one Is that guy the requirement came to stream with snipe you? It's like, yeah. bring a gift or don't fucking show up. <laughs> no, <laughs> that's why it was so nice. I've never been somewhere where everybody brought me a gift the whole time. It was just like, yeah, it just blew my mind. Like this one guy came, brought me a gift and like, Everyone's so polite and nice yeah. and sweet. Yeah, yeah. And he had me sign something and I sign it. And afterwards he goes, thanks, that was so nice. <laughs> <laughs> He jumped up and down. It was the cutest shit I've ever seen. He's like, thanks, bye. <laughs> like up and down like that. It was adorable. Did you have to deal with many uh, people being like, no, you can't film in here or anything like that? No. Oh, yeah, because Korea's really? chill. Yeah, Korea. Yeah. Yeah. Japan is quite the no, yeah, 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 unfortunately. Really? Yeah. Yeah. really? So that's one of the things I've over the years started to hate more and more about LA. And one of the like things that makes me want to leave is that mm. people are so pressed about whether or not you're filming. Do you have a yeah. filming permit? Never mind. You oh, can't really? film in people this are like that? Oh, in LA? Really? In a, yeah. Oh, wait, oh in the mall. Wait, so in the, wait, yeah, because me and Ludwig were in round one. And the moment we stepped out of round one to go in the mall to do our intro, because yeah. it was like, quieter, no. a yeah. dude immediately came and was like, no, get back in the round one. Really? Oh, yeah. Wow. But round that's one was weird. chill. So oh, see, Japan nice. is like that, except they'll say it to you in the nicest way possible. Yeah. Aww. Yeah, they'll just be like, no, oh, sorry, the no cameras here. Aww. You know, you're gonna have to go out. Cause yeah, cause I've, <laughs> I've been on a couple of IRL streams with Rob and you know, he obviously goes to like malls and shit like yeah. that. So he yeah. constantly gets people being like, sorry, you can't film in here or like, sorry, you can't yeah. do it. Yeah, it's, but it's just a matter of like, okay, it, we'll leave. It's odd because if you say you're streaming, mm. sometimes they're like, oh, okay then. But then recording is like a big no. But streaming right. is it's different. The same thing. It's because yeah. it's just it's recording with extra stats. No, so. no, in yeah, Japan yeah. it's the weird thing of like you can take photos, but you can't record video. Yeah. Like, what's the difference? Oh, yeah, a video is many. Yep. Yeah, well, yeah, right, right. L right. Luckily, the uh, I think the IRL cameras are small, so yes. they don't get as True. intimidated. Yeah. If, if you, you're carrying if you, around like a DSLR. Oh, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely. They yeah. get freaked out. Yeah, yeah. In Korea, not a single place. Oh my, if I, God. oh my God, I went shopping in one store and there was another girl live streaming a girl try on the clothes. I was like, I wanna live here. <laughs> I like this. <laughs> when you say I'm a live streamer, that's what they're gonna think. You would do you, fashion. Would yeah. you ever live in uh, Korea or any other country? Yeah. Um, I think the only issue for me is again, like time zones. Yeah, time zone audience. issues. Yeah, mm. I wouldn't know if that would impact no, they'd my follow audience you. in some they'd way. Follow you. Yeah, they'd follow you. And well, you get a new audience as well, <laughs> yeah. right? Yeah. I would one. start building a new audience, I think, but it does kind of feel like starting over in a way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I 
<laughs> and then all these new videos, why Pokimane fell? <laughs> the downfall of Pokimane. <laughs> Bruh, I'm tired. <laughs> but yeah, I think, I think though I would you go for like a month, maybe. Yeah. Like mm, that would yeah. be so fun. Yeah, I feel like you've definitely established yourself enough where if you did move to a new time zone, people would just be like, okay, I'll just, just something to get used to. I think it'd be this easier is, with VOD than streaming. This is why I'm yeah. saying. If it was the just VOD, yeah. If you make the content around the videos, because, okay, let's say I got a stream, right? Like, uh, let's say total 200,000 people watch the whole stream. Like, quadruple that, watch the video. True. Yeah. No, I think that's like yeah. the best way of content yeah, creation. Yeah. Legit. This episode is sponsored by Harry's. Listen, boys, we're busy. We're busy boys. Busy, busy we boys. Are, and we are. I need a shave that is fast, clean, and effective, and Harry's does it all. As I've mentioned like a billion times on these ad reads, like you I- can't you, stop. You I, can't stop. I, I, I'm you addicted can't stop. to Harry's. Say it I, once again. Say it again. Say it again. I love Remind Harry's. the audience. You know, we can't get Harry's in Japan. Oh, every time I go to the UK, I bring back a ton because you can get them there because it's the cleanest shave. No other razor gives me a shave like Harry's does. It's insane how good of a shave you get for how low the price is. I have never used used an, another razor since getting my first Harry's. <laughs> well, Connor, you'll be glad to know because right now you can get the Harry starter set for just $3. $3? $3. And plus you'll get a free travel size body wash as Which well. Is lovely. Oh my Lord. The set includes a five blade razor, weighted handle, foaming shave gel, and mm. a travel cover, a $16 value for $3 reduce. Just visit harrys.com slash trash taste. It is actually an insane deal. It's yeah. like, that's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Straight up, that's crazy. Back, Back to, the to the episode. episode. <laughs> <laughs> I just had to start realizing like, doesn't matter if there's like a dead time in the stream, because it's all gonna get fucking oh, cut anyway. Good. Yeah, as long as the video's good. Yeah, because because you it just completely shifts your mindset. Because sometimes you have a stream that's not doing well, like viewer wise, but yeah. you know, hey, at least the video. Yeah, but you know that the, video, video. that the it's gonna be a bang of video. Mm. And you're gonna like make that money back. Yeah, because I, I had like uh, I I had some of the most viewership I'd ever had playing Elden Ring, and oh. yeah, which is I think the opposite for like most people. Yeah. And I I was shocked. I was like, wow. And but the videos did terribly. Like no one gave a fuck because there's, I don't know if there's just so many Elden Ring That's videos or what. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Things yeah. work yeah. better on. Yeah. Really strange. Yeah. yeah. So if, just because it's doing well live doesn't mean it's going to lend itself well to doing mm. well for a video. Exactly. And also, just because it's doing well or not well for a certain stream, it doesn't mean it's not going to do well for you, right? Like, yeah. Oh yeah. yeah I've yeah, had yeah. I've had like I've played a bunch of like story based games on my streams where I'm just like, no, that that doesn't get viewership oh, anywhere don't fucking else. Want to hear no. you play story but like, games. yeah, yeah, like I I remember like my Pokemon Arceus streams at one point were doing like better than a lot of other streams I was doing, right. like seven eight streams oh, into wow. it, and I'm just like, oh. Cool. Pop I thought I thought King. this was gonna suck Pop near the end, King. but yeah, it was awesome. And then and then I try and do something else that is like big for other people and yeah. it doesn't and it quite do as well yeah. for me, right? So yeah, it's like yeah. I've just noticed now, not just the content creator, mm. but sometimes the audience, like the art. Of audience course, you've mm. garnered might prefer certain things. Yeah, around. absolutely. Yeah. So uh, that was uh, at that point, I was just like, yeah, I'm just gonna fucking do whatever I want to do. Also, some people will just it. lend well to certain games and certain activities, yeah. and other personalities yeah. just don't. Yeah, yeah. exactly. So. Absolutely. Would you ever want to stream in Japan? I already have, <laughs> and I will again. You're gonna well, go to a combi when. for six fucking hours. Yeah, 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 yeah. I want to see if you do an IRL <laughs> stream at a combi in Japan. I want to see how well that will do. I bet it's gonna do really well. Honestly, honestly, I, it will, I think streams? it'll do. I think it'll do frustratingly well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Japan do is... streams do numbers. What I want to do in Japan again is just yeah. go to an arcade and play a claw game for six hours. That was like some of the most fun I had. I don't even know why. <laughs> yeah, like you're playing a game. But IRL. But That's you can do that. But you can do that here. Um, no. But it's really. it's not as exotic if it's yeah. not in Japan, <laughs> you know. Even though it's the same company, that it's round and- one, the same arcades, you're playing the same games. You put Japan in the title. That's viewers true. are gonna watch, right? Not just that, but also um, going to round one would be difficult. I can't. I don't stream anywhere in LA. Like I will not mm, do it right, unless yeah. I can book out the whole place. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. We're a stream like, snipe I as feel well. Right, right. A, thousand times safer in Korea and Japan than I do here. Yeah. Which is sad because that's like, that's a huge IRL streaming like mm. limitation. Mm, I, yeah. I don't feel safe just walking around with a backpack alone or even with someone. Mm. Yeah. That's just, that goes beyond streaming though, right? Yeah, that's just in general, I think. Like, <laughs> yeah. Even just visiting here, I, I'm immediately like, I don't feel safe in a lot of Places. Yeah, we did. Yeah. Uh, me and Ludwig did the uh, round one stream, and that was uh, that was that was okay. It was it was the first hour was fine, but then obviously when people start figuring out where you are, 
And just then it started angry. ramping up because mm. we weren't we weren't moving around. We were just in round one. Mm. Yeah. Uh, it was fine. People were really nice though. I think round one attracts a good crowd though, luckily. True. But then we're, we're, we're also guys. I love so. going to round one offline. Yeah. yeah. Like, wait a second. Oh my God, the manager recognized me once. She like, she started crying. I was like. <laughs> yeah, we were around one the other day and one of the employees there was like, oh, you can just, just come come up and I'll just get you a ticket. Yeah. Aww. Yeah, I was just like, oh, okay, cool. I felt really bad because there was like a bunch of people lining up. I'm like, no, no, no I'll, I'll, I'll wait in oh, line. You got a free ticket? Yeah. Fuck, I paid for mine. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I wish he d fixed that stupid mega stacker machine. That shit was bullshit. Oh this yeah. This is a machine where the blocks, you know, they go across and you gotta- Yeah, they skip it. They, yeah. they it, skip it. I, I, they yeah. absolutely skip it. Yeah. I've played that one up yeah. there. Yeah. I, yeah. You know the one? Cause I'm a gamer. So like, no. I, I can get to the last one, no problem. I'm not a fucking idiot. And then it, you press it and it fucking goes, right over at the end. Intentionally. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It has to be on like a lottery system. Yeah. From that. <laughs> I went on a date with a guy once when we went to round one. It was so heckin' fun. Cause yeah. he's like more of a normie and I'm just like gaming my ass off the yeah. whole time. <laughs> and he has a little like card with the money and he's like, eh. and I'm like, eh. and he's like, eh. again, okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and I was stuck on that one for so long. And Did I knew, no, I knew I was doing it's, it right. It's a con dude. I was getting so pressed and he's like, again, okay. <laughs> yeah. I, yeah. I was like, this game is bugged, I swear yeah. to yeah. God. I am doing a frame perfect like, input. Yeah. No legit. Like I'm I <laughs> dude, the, the summoning salt video was in the making, dude. Yeah. I, 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 it was it was yeah, I I think we I spent like an hour on ski ball trying to yeah. get uh eight. You know the ten thousand in the corner, like the hardest one to get? Yeah. I was like, I'm gonna get eight out of nine to get the bonus. And I could only get seven. I was like a machine though. Like, you were there for yeah. like an Boom. hour and a half yeah. just trying to I had, a, get I, I had dudes come up to me who were like, dude, you fucking sick at this shit. And like they fist bumped me and I'm like, I'm j I do not care. I want these tickets. Leave me the fuck alone. It was it was Damn, like man. it was like You're seeing really Connor good at throwing balls. Like, yeah, 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 right. It was like seeing Connor playing IRL jump king, because it was just like yeah. the same movement over and over. Before I, swear, I was, was trying like to perfect the body hour. movement of throwing yeah. it in the exact same spot. Yeah, because yeah. I remember at one point. Yeah, 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 I was yeah. like, <laughs> it's like, it's all in the hips. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's all in the hips. <laughs> yeah. no, because I remember at one point in the night, I was like, I, I saw you from across the room, like yeah. playing skee ball. And I'm like, oh, okay, he's playing skee ball. I'll just go to the rhythm machine games a couple of times. Yeah. I feel I was there for like an hour. I came back and he's like, still there, but yeah. like 10 times sweatier. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was really getting into it. Cause I was getting, I, my goal was to just get as many high scores as uh, the thing as possible. Mm. I'd got like the high score on like my second try on this beanbag tossing bullshit. Yeah. And I was like, dude, I'm actually nuts. I yeah. just gotta get the high score on everything. Yeah. And uh, yeah, that broke me. There was also another thing that like, there was just like this fucking milk tossing thing and it was driving me insane. And I, yeah. I was getting angry that I couldn't get the high score. Yeah. It was like a milk jug and you have to throw a ball into it. But it was the the thing was designed so that the ball wouldn't bounce Fun, in nicely. Yeah. yeah. And it was I was like, is it me? Is it, am I am I bad? <laughs> am I not getting or is the enough? jug? Yeah. Bullshit. And yeah, I was like freaking out at this I round can, one. You know, I can get over a jug being bullshit or me not perfecting my ski ball, but yeah. that when it when they actually when it's programmed. Yeah, yeah. When it's yeah. when it's programmed. programmed to make you lose, oh that was that's so yeah. Then it's a scam, right? It's just a scam. It yeah, really yeah. is. That's yeah. why I get addicted to games where I know it's not a scam and I'm just bad. Cause I'm yeah. like, I like, yeah, I know I'm the, I'm fun. the problem. But when they con me, I'm like vehemently against it. I'm like, yeah. absolutely yeah. fucking not. I hate <laughs> you. I hate you so much. Yep. See, that's why I was like glad I was a casual gamer. Cause we all started with the same amount of credits. I think me and Joey just spent like an hour or two in the rhythm game section, mm. just having a fucking great time. Yeah. And then we come over to Connor and he's like almost run out of credits. Yeah. And we're like, dude, we got like 500 credits left. The we all soul's just like- yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Him. That's why I like rhythm games though, because you, <laughs> You, you get the experience you pay it's for It's value for time. money. You get, you yeah. get value that, for money. To be fair, yeah. right. yeah. ski ball was only like 25 cents a pop. Yeah, but you, you ran through that in like yes, 10 but seconds. Your happiness at the end, their yeah. happiness. Yeah, at the yeah, end. yeah. I walked away with a Minecraft glow up light. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm a winner. You yeah, spent more money winner. than us, yeah. that's why. Like, Shut the fuck up. I'm a winner. <laughs> we literally put the same amount <laughs> yeah, of money yeah. in the cards. I'm sorry I spent my money faster than you. Yeah. 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 I, I, we literally spent like half the amount that you spent. Cause like, I, I like it's I remember like. Competition. Like we're, huh? we're all rich. It's fine. It's a competition for you. Everything's a competition for you. Don't lie to me like that. <laughs> that makes everything a competition. <laughs> no, because like, I remember we were just playing like the rhythm games. I'm like, damn, you get three songs for one credit? Yeah. Holy shit. That's like a good 10 minutes at yeah. least and for one credit. And here's Connor going, 
<laughs> like it's only three credits, guys. It's like, like I didn't credits. know you could speed run ski ball until yeah. I saw it. <laughs> the one thing I will say that I think round one America does better than round one Japan or anything Japan is is the card. Oh yeah. None of the arcades in Japan, even though they have cards mm-hmm. that keep your progression, mm-hmm. no one has decided on a system that allows you to just load up money on a card. Because I do, it's I, so I, simple. Yeah, no, yeah, there is a system, and probably it's just not profitable. used as often. Yeah, yeah. and I so and it only works for some machines. And yeah. so there's you can pay with like Suica, which is like a tapping thing. But mm-hmm. the the thing is fucking like you have to pick the thing you want to pay with, pick the money you have to pay with, then yeah. have to ho- hold it, and it, just, it doesn't work <laughs> as well. Yeah, yeah. Because I, I do these videos where I do like the crane game, uh, playing against <laughs> each other. And I have to carry around just a sack of money to just put in it. It's fine. To be fair, that's kind of funny for the video. Yeah, yeah, but it's I've spilt it before and it's really awkward because I'm like, but also great for the video. Yeah, it's good. How do I hold all this money? (laughs) It is is a visceral feeling going like doom, doom, doom. Yeah, Yeah. it's nice. But when you're spamming a game, yeah, 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 they have IRL gacha as well. Like they have like uh, you put like a ten bucks in, and then you get like a ball, and then you might you can win like an. Oh yeah, yeah, that was fun as fuck. Yeah, I do yeah. like doing those, but uh, I've never won anything good. No. Only uh, Pokemon Arceus, but I already had a copy of it, so <laughs> it's just sitting in my room. It was kind of high. Yeah, it's kind of nice. Yeah. No, it was it was that. a waste of money. Ron one is so fun. It's good. It is. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Round yeah. one America is really good. I thought it was yeah. dog shit. I was mm. kind of surprised too mm. when I went to the one near here. Because yeah. I because I've been to some pretty fucking sad arcades in the U.S. Like, yeah, yeah. I, I went to a Dave and Buster's. Oh, Dave and no, Buster's no, 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 no. is oh, that's, that's my that's, trigger that's, word. Yeah. You yeah. think you think arcades are bad? Like they can be bad here in the U.K. They are pathetic. Oh my god, there is nothing in the U.K. Well, in I Australia to, as well, this shit. Yeah. 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 When I went to round one, like I I I had such a great time. I thought about all the people that only know of Dave and Buster's. <laughs> You know, I, is that's Dave Buster's bad? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because prior to, prior to it's this the time, the most mid arcade you could possibly yeah. think of. Same thing. Okay. You say it's a mid arcade compared to the arcades in the UK. That's still like yeah. a ten out of ten arcade. If the machines and- work, it's better than the one in the UK. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Half yeah. of them they never work. The buttons are like I remember they had like uh, this is one really popular arcade in London. Just half yeah, the machines just, just don't work. Yeah. LV time cri- scam. Yeah, yeah, time crisis. You can you can p- put the money in, but yeah. the gun just doesn't fucking track. Yeah, and, but you've already put your money in. So yeah. it's like, and like I'm, the, I'm if, if you get over. a machine that's like, it's it's impossible to get a machine that's like below fully functional. Yeah, well. fully functional below like ten years old because all yeah. the games are like old as hell. Mm. Like here, you actually get like proper rhythm games, proper yeah. arcade games, proper claw machines. In the UK, there's fucking nothing. Yeah, I was surprised how up to date the round one was when we went to, especially like the rhythm games. I was yeah. like, oh, this is it nothing has- like yeah. right from Japan. This is nothing like the Dave and Buster's yeah, that I yeah. went to that one time. Yeah, <laughs> dude, there's this like mech game that you can play in Japanese arcades that's so fucking sick where you get to pilot a mech and it's got hydraulics and it fucking that moves around. That sounds so fun. And it's yeah. a battle royale as well. Yeah. yeah so yeah. so you're literally battling against, against other mech pilots. Yeah, yeah, other mech pilots online and you are literally like, piloting a mech. There's that many mechs? Oh yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Even in the one arcade, the one we went to where we discovered that game, there was like, I think eight machines. Yeah. yeah. Fully, just like, that game. Yeah. fully like hydraulic machines that you sit, you have to put wear a seatbelt. Yeah. Oh my God, or I'm gonna try stop. that. So yeah. like when you move forward, it's like, and you actually like lean yeah. back yeah, and yeah. forth. Yeah, it's, it's, it's nuts. awesome. And it's like a hundred yen. Yep, I would game. have like the best hacking time step out. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> that was great. Yeah. <laughs> One of the most recent like, uh, Rumors? I don't know what you call them. Yeah. That was spread about me was that I do cocaine on stream. I don't know if you guys saw that. That's one. fucking tight, dude. That's fucking tight. Let's do it, dude. Fuck. Let's and rip you want to know why? Because when I was 18 or 19, mm-hmm. <laughs> wait, you guys know the Japan crate? Things. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I had those and there was like a candy that was like white powder, yeah. you know? And I like lined it up and I made this joke. A joke when I was yeah. 19. Yeah. Right. And people found that clip and they're like, oh my gosh, she does cocaine mm. on stream. Wow. So you think substance like, abuse is funny? Yeah. You sense a joke about wow. it? Wow. <laughs> wow. I can't oh, fucking no. believe it. Don't get my ideas, please. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. Very. Okay. Was that the most ridiculous rumor that's been spread around you? I think that's like the most recent. Right. I, yeah. Probably one of the most ridiculous. Yeah. Mm. Especially for someone who like, I don't really drink, I don't do drugs. Yeah. But yeah. I'm kind of boring, low key. And they're like, you do cocaine on stream. Like right. imagine. <laughs> yeah. Let's just Crazy. break a federal law on stream and uh, publicize so this. Yeah. not doing anything right. about yeah. it. <laughs> about these heckin' cocaine snorting streamers. <laughs> She's just trying to hype herself up. It's yeah, right. yeah. 
Have you had th- have you had any other like ridiculous rumors that you've that's just like popped up? I'm sure you're you've had your fair share. Yeah. 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 Sometimes hard to think of until they just come up mm. like this. Speaking oh, yeah. of crack. <laughs> Speaking of crack, you know. You know, you know that was one of the most bizarre controversies I think you got in was the the band word list. Oh my god. I mean, people that got was, mad about all sorts yeah, of things. They're yeah. Like she has these banned words and I'm like yeah, because weirdos online abuse. What is this controversy? I am, I, so yeah, yeah, I think someone leaked some of your banned words, right? Were they? Were, yeah, yeah, maybe, yeah, maybe. maybe. I uh, gen like. Yeah. I remember pe- people being upset that I banned words in my chat. Mm. Well, like of, of yeah, course, of course, I yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah I because it like just... it was a thing at the point with like all the leafy videos and his. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. No, it's totally By understandable. The way, like half of my unbanned forms or unbanned requests nowadays are like, oh, I was a cringy leafy fanboy. Sorry about that. I've grown and learned. <laughs> Literally 50% of my unbanned forms. We love it. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, like, yeah. We love a good, yeah. you know. We, we love, love a good redemption story. mark, you know. <laughs> true, everyone true, everyone true. loves that. Um, yeah, so I think people at some point were mad that I had a bunch of ban words. Well, yeah, that was- For weird. what? I don't know. No. Actually, one weird controversy I do want to like hear your opinion about is uh, the VTubing controversy. Oh yeah. Like what the fuck <laughs> happened there? Like- okay, so for anyone that might not know, mm. uh, like mm-hmm. the beginning of the pandemic-ish, at some point, mm. I thought VTubers were so cool. Yeah. And I, I yeah. love me some good anime girl art, right? right. So yeah, I yeah. got um, like a VTubing model done and I was like, well, this could be a fun thing to use if I don't feel like being on camera. Right, yeah. And then when I came out with it, I'll, like, I think a lot of people were really mad. Yeah. 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 But, like I saw that people were mad, but at the same time I was like, why? Yeah, where, where was like in, in that controversy, oh, not controversy, but that's whatever the fuck that, you want to call it. Yeah. Uh, where was the majority of like the, the backlash coming from there? Like, yeah. what, was it your like, audience? Who was, was, who, who was oh, mad? No, for sure not my audience. If anything, they were intrigued. Yeah. And funnily enough, in hindsight, I'm like, I hope I was a positive force in like VTubers becoming more popular. Mm. Yeah. Because I think a lot of my audience is probably very different from the VTubing audience, but yeah. I helped mm. probably like normalize the idea yeah. of like using this sort of tech. Right. Um, Obviously, VTubers are popping because yeah, 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 yeah. Their yeah, content yeah, yeah. is so cool. But I think people were just mad because <laughs> I think a lot of people were used to being mad at me. If that makes sense, right? Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Like, that's that's, that's how I felt. Yeah. yeah. Um, and then I think some other ones. It was probably like a little bit of a gatekeeping thing, partially understandable, where they're yeah. like, "We don't want you to like ruin this sacred community." Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Which obviously feels bad for me because I'm like, I obviously am not looking to ruin anything. Like this yeah. is a cool piece of tech that I want to showcase to more people. It's, yeah. it, it's mm. a dumb argument when you look at the fact that many corporate entities have VTuber models. Yeah. yeah. Mm. So I I mean, come on, you can't blame a person who's a creator for doing it when there's fucking, I don't know, an, I think an airline has one and it's like, for what purpose? I mean, like, nowadays yeah. fucking every Japanese Everyone company has, has a VTuber. Yeah, and it's just uh, Crunchyroll, like, they have one yeah. as well. You yeah. know. Everyone has it. Yeah. Like, why a you, lot why, of yeah, my you, friends made them as well. Yeah. Like, they're just fun were you, and cute. Were you expecting any controversy when you launched your VTuber model? Um, or was it just like, oh, here we go again. Yeah. You know? They found something I else. Was, <laughs> I think it was an in-between where I was just like so used to it. I was like, people yeah. are gonna be mad at yeah, whatever. Yeah. Right. But I think it was an instance where I wasn't that upset because I was actually reassured by a lot of like really, really nice and cool VTubers. I think Iron Mouse, Iron Mouse might've been one of them. Mm. Right. If memories. Or, yeah. Um, and they were like, no, like this is cool. Why not? She's like bringing more eyes to the community. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she's like being nice and respectful and yeah. she commissioned someone from the community. Like if anything, it's like bringing more work yeah, to yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh my God, I remember at that time, everybody was booked up for months. Like oh, if yeah. you were oh, doing yeah. Yeah. for oh, yeah. months, it was over yeah. 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 Well, I think the so, issue- yeah, it was like yeah. a, a good time I hope for yeah, because I think the issue at that time was that VTubing was still like this underground thing, hadn't mm-hmm. like broken into like the Especially mainstream. Especially in the West. Especially yeah. in the West, yeah. you know, in Japan, totally different culture. Yep. But in the West, it was still like this underground thing mm-hmm. that was kind of get, getting traction. And it kind of felt like, I'm sure to a lot of fans being like, you know, when your underground indie band yes. comes yes. out to so get signed up by like a big company and you're like, damn, yeah. they've, they've, look at all these normies coming I to like enjoy it. the it's same like, thing like, I enjoy. Like, oh yeah, I love that band. I heard them in the Marvel movie. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much more than that. Bro. 
<laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, and I think there's been a similar sentiment for a lot of people with Twitch. Mm. Where oh, they're yeah. like, oh, Twitch becoming more mainstream and normie and Minecraft kids. Yeah. But I personally obviously kind of biased. I feel like it's better for the platform overall to be more inclusive. Mm, yeah. And you can still have your pockets of yeah. whatever the heck you mm, want. Yeah. yeah. Um, I missed so the times I, when it was called justin.tv. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, remember those times? Yeah, good old days. <laughs> I mean, I understand the sentiment, <laughs> but I also think there isn't really any one person or force anyone should be mad at yeah. when things get more popular. That's yeah. just like the life cycle of a product yeah. sometimes. Right, right. If just, it's a good product. Just blame yeah. society. That's, that's, yeah. that's we live in a society. society. We live in a society, society, in a society. Where get popular. Sag. Yeah. I got to ask, okay. There's, there's, there's one thing I do want to hear why you did it. Okay. Watching Avatar on stream. Oh, <laughs> naughty, naughty. Okay, we're, we're bringing out the yeah. hard questions yeah. now. <laughs> we're bringing so, out the hard so, questions. So this isn't Gant's first rodeo. <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah. you, you, you did it previously, right? On uh, offline TV. Yeah, yeah, I asked host about yeah. it as oh, well. Really? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I watched Avatar on stream mm. because well, it's just a really, really great show. It's it such is. an amazing show. Do you have no respect for the copyright holders, Pokemon? Well, what's copyright? It's a great story. Yeah. Character development. Not just, yeah. I really thought Avatar needed my exposure. Now yeah. oh, <laughs> oh, that, no, that oh, had a narrative oh, 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 behind no, it. No, no. That had a okay, narrative behind it. Let me explain. Yeah, 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 yeah. So on Twitch, mm -hmm. metas are yeah, very, yeah. very common. Mm -hmm. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. There is a Among Us meta, Fortnite meta. And meta just means like, what is most popular? What is really bringing viewership, et right. cetera, et cetera. Right. Yeah. If you want to be a streamer that has a very, very long lifespan and career, you must change with the times, at least to some degree. Mm -hmm. Twitch had gotten to a point where they weren't personally um, like banning people for playing copyrighted content. Yeah, they they were essentially like a safe haven for that kind of thing, yeah, and right. they forced the copyright holder to take down that content themselves. Yeah. Right, and so what happened was you had major, very very large streamers like Toast, as you said, XQC, yeah. Yeah. like. Everybody just started watching flat out TV shows and mm. movies and whatever. Yeah. yeah. He watched um, Death Note. Yeah. Yeah. I think he watched Naruto or, as well. Naruto. Or and next you see all was watching Hunter Hunter. Right Hunter now. Hunter. Yeah. 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 So you had these people watching all these shows, and Miss Kiff also watched the Avatar on stream. Yeah. So obviously, to me, I'm like, oh well, these people watched yeah. things on. Yeah. Let me watch the same thing that yeah. someone has already streamed right. to a similar sized audience as me. Yeah. But I got hit with the DMs. <laughs> and then the pirating meta began. <laughs> which, which, which to, to be fair, is well deserved. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, I agree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I fully knew okay, good, that good. I was taking a risk yeah. and they are wholly within it's, their right yeah. to so, in, in whack me in the face. Yeah, because yeah. what I want to know was like, did you all did you all know that you were just like, okay, we're gonna wait for the first person to get hit and then we're, we're gonna stop afterwards. Yes. Okay. Yeah. No okay. legit. Right. It was basically like, oh, this is a normalized thing. Mm. Right, right. At this point. Um, so even like, yeah, it was just a, a tricky situation. If, if, uh, and if, if we watched anime in Japan, we'd go to jail. Yeah. We're doing it on stream. Because yeah. really? fair, fair use is not a law. You, and, yeah. Yeah, and the kind of abusing copywriters, like oh. they, they really go after it there. Yeah. Uh, but I, I think for us, it was kind of like, what the, what the fuck is happening? Because, <laughs> you know, a lot of the time we'd worked with Japanese corporations and we were yeah. trying to build up that bridge of like, nah, YouTubers and Twitch, they're not scary. Come on, yeah. just like work with us. And then it was like, please don't look at what is happening. Please, <laughs> yeah. please, please. Stay on YouTube. <laughs> it's like, these ain't our mans. These they, ain't they, our mans. They, they, okay. they are not like us. We do not. Because it was like, oh, Oh my God, this goodwill that we're trying to bring. Uh, and then because they're, they're so like, what these companies know, are so scared. Yeah. I know, yeah. yeah. I think I worked with Crunchyroll on something and they are like very, I mean, not and it's Crunchyroll not even, themselves, it's, it's, but when yeah. it comes to handling the actual yeah, anime, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. it's not very, even very strict. them half the time that they're, that like why they're scared. It's like, because they have the Japanese people breathing yes. down their neck, yeah. just yeah. being like, yeah. you, if you Better fuck up, we are going to pull the shop. show. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is again, very understandable. And honestly, I felt really bad about yeah. that because like- Yeah, where's the apology video? Yeah, where's yeah. The apology? That's where you should have made an apology video about. And then I would have watched it on stream and fucking laughed at you. <laughs> Abusing yeah. copyright is no, no joke. Why didn't Listen. you make an apology video so we could have clicked <laughs> If Imagine my luck, like someone who is mm. 
Yeah. No, scrutinize to no end. Yeah, and yeah. you have no. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. But this was the one instance I wasn't. Yeah. And it's like, you have so many other, even larger streamers than me doing this thing. And as soon as I do it, I'm the one who- I, I, I was it, honestly, you know? I was really appalled Stop. mainly with uh, Twitch. I yeah. couldn't believe that they let it's it go on. how inconsistent they yeah, are. Yeah, yeah. How long it yeah. is. And like the no, whole- No, no, but Twitch- they don't give a fuck. They I know didn't they do give. anything then. Yeah. They aren't doing anything I just now. can't believe. They just say copyright holder. If you find it, then it's on you to tell us and then we'll take it down. It just, yeah, it just felt like it was like, cause I mean, we were, we were all on YouTube before the apocalypse. Yeah. So we were just like, it was just like Vietnam flashbacks. Yeah. Of like, oh no, oh, <laughs> here it goes. Oh, yeah. oh no, here we go. <laughs> yeah. Oh fuck. People on Twitch were worried about that too. Luckily yeah. that's not what ended up happening. Yeah. Um, I, I feel like do, something's do think, gonna happen Do you down think the line. there's an inevitability, inevitability that something like that is going to happen on Twitch? Cause I don't think anyone expected it to happen on YouTube until it happened. No, everyone was yeah. really cool. I think yeah. It's well established enough that it likely won't. However, I do think we're heading into a recession. I mean, we're tech. Recession. Yeah, we are, yeah, yeah. We're, yeah, we're basically we are. in a recession. Well, so we're is the entire world right now, I think. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> sorry, I was gonna say, I think because of that, we might see similar things of like, mm. right. not as many sponsorships, not as many crazy yeah. ad rates. Yeah. yeah. So it might almost feel like an adpocalypse, but right. it won't have anything to do with the platform right. or the content. The entire world is going through an adpocalypse right now. Fuck my wall. <laughs> Fuck. Yes. Yo. It's Worldwide like, yo, what are we getting? Like uh, inflation? you like, you know, did, did <laughs> no, they no, create just I, like- I do think, I mean, am I the one who feels like content creators have been a little bit um, overvalued for like uh, a year or two? Um, like mm. some things are just like crazy Maybe you're, you're at the rates. top though. You're at the top. So you get the maybe premium. Maybe. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're, we're little bottom feeders. Yeah, just yeah, make nice. our way. Yeah. Just trying to get by. Guys, they're in a million billion dollar, <laughs> like a million billions, <laughs> a million billion dollar mansion. <laughs> Talking about. Mm -mm. That's, that's that's our patrons, man. We yeah. thank you very much, patrons. Thank you by very the way, much, patrons. yeah, we have to fight tooth and nails for like any company to like to take us oh, seriously. Yeah, really? like, yeah. Bro, but you guys are like a really well, especially in Japan though. Oh, yeah, yeah, you'd think with yeah. you know uh, we're doing pretty good. Yeah, uh, you need to hit up people in America. Yeah, that's, that's why. Like, I felt here in LA, everyone's just like, "Yes, yes, King, say what you want. <laughs> yes, what you what you know, like, what do you want to say? What do you want to do? How do you want to work together? Yeah. Yeah. And like in Japan, it's just like." Why are you here at my door? Like, <laughs> who is Why this? are you on your knees begging? Yeah, who Please is this stop. random sassy child that's just appeared on I'm my sorry, doorstep? I'm sorry, do you speak Japanese? I didn't think so. Yeah, exactly, Get right? Out. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Oh, yeah, I like that. Yeah, it's, it's been a totally different, it's it's almost been like a culture shock mm. here. Mm. Just yeah. seeing how Yeah, the infrastructure is totally different. But them yeah. combinis though, really fuck, really fuck dude. Those combinis, oh, yeah. yeah. The what? The combinis, the, the, the convenience stores. Convenience stores. Sorry, fuck, that's Sorry, Japanese language. Sorry, I wouldn't understand. Yeah, you're I really don't. You guys are just so much. You can you can watch this uh, podcast on stream if you want. By the way, that's okay. Yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, yeah, you, of course you're fine. Yeah, we, yeah, we, we, of course we you can. Yeah. People do it all the time. We don't care. What are we going to copy go. strike your own? Your, your you own. Could. It's your I was just joking, content. but that, you, yeah, yeah. Okay, you can. Nice. I was just. I will, and then we'll make well, a special video where we where we just go around copy striking yeah. all of your streams. Where you uh, yeah, well, when as, I, as long as we can react to you reacting to this, then yeah. then it's all good. React to me reacting. I, well, when I did yes. a like a subathon and I went to bed, I just played episodes of Trash Taste. That's what I did. Oh, that's really nice. Because oh, I was like, I can't great. believe I can't believe you be breaking our copyright. Yeah. It's two and a half hours of content, yeah. and I can. There's so fucking There's much so of it. There's so many. Yeah. Legit. Yeah. Why well, would you watch Avatar when you could just watch all yeah. of Trash Taste, right? There's way more content. They're all the same. Could have, caught up. Could have caught up. Exactly the same kind of content, actually. Exactly. It's just one is a bit longer. Yeah. Dude, I'm, there's I'm just as the, much lore well, in Trash Taste. We have and said, character development. Yeah, exactly. I'm, just saying, I'm just saying the Trash Taste meta, that's going to be the next meta. <laughs> Everyone should stop would, watching MasterChef. I mean, there, yeah, there was a Gordon yeah. Ramsay. Meta. Yeah, there was. There was. So there like was. watching TV shows and movies almost got like normalized, and they're like, "Eff it, anime." Yeah, yeah. yeah. I wonder who was the first one to be like, you know what? Fuck it. Let's just watch fucking whole TV shows. Let's just do it. I forget. I feel oh, like it, it was a uh, XQC, XQC wasn't know. it? Watching MasterChef. I thought. Mm. I thought it started with like him watching MasterChef. No, I think a lot of other people watched MasterChef before he did. Right. But I don't know who like. Yeah. Took it that step further and did anime. Well, yeah. Mind you, can I just say like, <laughs> it was, you know, XUC, Toast, Miz, yeah. me, we all did yeah. it. A lot of people did mm. it. And so many other streamers were like, okay, it's time to watch it now, <laughs> which doesn't make it okay. <laughs> but just to say like, I think a lot of people, 
assume mm. if something isn't being punished yeah. mm-hmm. and it's like, it seems yeah. permissible, yeah. Mm, right? Yeah. Even mm. if it's not okay. Yeah. What do you think about React content Bad in general? Um, it's not that deep. It it's not that deep? All right, okay. Yeah. Just- I think there's kind of a middle ground, mm. obviously. Mm. What is your question specifically? I think it's like, it's interesting talking about talking about it with streamers. Again, coming from YouTube initially, because uh, I don't know if you followed YouTube history, but there was this like whole movement for like two years where it was like React content is the plague. It's disgusting. Jinx, right? It's the, the worst. Yeah. 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 And there was this whole thing of like, so when I came to Twitch, I was like, oh, everyone loves it here. Like yeah. it's, and it's kind of crazy seeing like yeah, the, the 180, it. right? Mm. Um, and yeah, and it's, really, it's conflicting. In my, they in only ways. love it now. Again, yeah. back when all those videos and all that stuff, mm, how yeah. people were like, she just reacts to uh, videos. And that makes her spawn of the devil. Mm, and right. now it's like so normalized. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Cause everyone's doing it. Yeah, and yeah. it's crazy to look back and be like, people were mad at me for so many things that nobody <laughs> cares about now. Yeah. What's that about? Yeah, <laughs> it's just it, the longer I've been on the internet, the longer you realize, man, people just have really short memories. Yeah, like yes. unless, it's all cycles, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. People get angry really easily, but unless you have done something like you know, fucking diddle children or whatever, people yeah. are just gonna fucking forget about. Yeah, that. most of the time it's people just people can- forget about that. Sometimes, <laughs> yeah. most of the time it's just it's just cancellation of the week. Basically, yeah, yeah. it's like oh, yeah. who's it today? Cancellation of the week. Yeah, it's yeah. like monster of the week. It's just like oh, who who is it this week? All right. I what? think React content is hard to talk about because there's. There's like such a spectrum of it. Like, yeah. are you it's, really it's, was, adding I, to the content a it's ton? A, it was yeah. an unfair question to me to ask. Oh. It, was, it was loaded, no, it was fine. loaded. No, yeah. Oh, I guess that's my answer. Like yeah. if you're adding to the content a ton, I think yeah. there's a very fair, like, I think you can have yeah. a, a discussion about whether or not that's fair use. And yeah. I think you have a good argument for it being well, fair I think, use. Well, I think YouTube definitely had that period where it's like, uh, Insert profession here reacts to something along the oh, lines of yeah. profession, yeah. right? It's like and that. I think, I think that's, that's fine. That's good content. Yeah. yeah. Are you really eating? To yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we go. We go for a long time on yeah. trash. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Guys, mind. Yeah. No, 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 go. Go. You're, you're already go doing it. So. <laughs> I'll only have three pieces. Burning <laughs> questions. Speed fire. Go. All right, top three anime. Yeah, well, was, I was gonna. Go. We, got, we got to talk about oh, anime. I know, at least I know for like one, a little one of your bit. favorite animes because yeah. you said it on my video. You like Parasite, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. You like the oh, you like Parasite? Parasite? <laughs> I fucking love that show though. Yeah. I've, yeah. So Parasite, Parasite is like, you know, it's like core memory growing up and watching that and just falling in love with that one. Mm, yeah. I love when he he lets Miggy take over his heart and he just becomes a fucking Chad. And then he just has- <laughs> When you see the before. He immediately, yeah. His hair goes spikes up. He, yeah. fucking, he yeah. just has sex right away. And it's like, this is the greatest show ever. Yeah. Again, character yeah. development. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay, what else? Um, I'm really bad with this kind of thing because I don't usually rank things. Like if you say yeah. your favorite movie, your favorite TV show, I'm like, oh, it's just, I just, just like easy to ask. Yeah. I know. Yeah. Is there any like personal favorites that you just want to shout just out? Just reword the question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because I mean, it, it matters to me. Because like yeah, when yeah. someone says, Yo, okay, okay, what's okay, your okay. top three? Okay, just t- yeah. tell us yeah. your favorites. Yeah. I like all the normal ones. I, I mean- Define, define normal. normal. <laughs> you mean like Shonen Jump, like, Demon Slayer, Jujutsu Kaisen. You're trying not to piss people off right now. I really know. I really wanted to say like a hentai as a joke, but I couldn't think of one. <laughs> you know, the normal anime is like yeah. cow girls be bop. <laughs> cow <laughs> girls be bop. I can imagine. Um, obviously I love Death Note growing up. I probably watched yeah. that like yeah. twice. Yeah, I watched that on Toaster Stream. When I, <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I never watched Naruto or One Piece. I've never watched Naruto. So yeah, 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 yeah. But one piece is worth. I hear that a lot, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. but like, I only have one lifetime. Yeah, yeah. Why would you not spend that lifetime yeah. watching one piece? <laughs> you like a uh, character development? You should watch a show called Baki. Oh yeah, yeah. you should watch Baki. That's one we advocate for. Yeah, it's, B-A-K-I. It's, it's like the ugliest yeah. fucking okay. thing. It's like these extremely muscular dudes just fighting each other. Yeah. And it's, but there's growth, there's growth there. Oh, yeah. It's, yeah. So. I've been enjoying Spike's family, obviously. Of course. I, I also enjoy food. Yes. Right, yeah. no, yeah, like, yeah. you, 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 yeah. you yeah. Jujutsu Kaisen, like Demon Slayer, everybody likes those. Yeah. Growing up, I like fell in love with Attack on Titan. I was like 14 yeah. in Morocco, in Africa, downloaded that, all the episodes. I forget you how have old no inter- Attack on I Titan know. Yeah. So fuck. now 27, I'm so mad <laughs> because like, if you had just fed me properly throughout the years, I'd still be happy today. But I feel like <laughs> Attack on Titan did not do that have for you, me. Uh, did it not? Keeping up with it? It's like, 
no that's Whoa. why i'm like you lost me throughout the years but i loved you so much initially you should get so used good. to it's so good now it's really? gotten yeah. better it gets okay. better every i'm gonna season. finish watching it yeah honestly well, it hasn't like finished yet yeah it's still going one, yeah. one more final yeah. season 15 well so so there's there's a, a 2013 right so nine years yeah, yeah. 2013 yeah, 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 it came yeah. out twenty thirteen. You weren't as young as you yeah, think. Yeah, yeah. Must have been like fifteen, sixteen. Yeah, that probably lines up. Yeah, right? yeah. I, think, I think it came out like the original attack, attack on Titan came out two thousand thirteen. Thirteen. Mm. Yeah. yeah, so yeah. it's been like, it's been nine so years. My favorite thing about anime, and you could probably understand okay. with yeah. Parasite a little bit, Tom? and Attack on Titan is just when it looks so fucked up, you know, wait, wait, in wait. a way that would never exist in humanity. Like these massive Titans with these giant- Oh yeah, oh yeah, 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 yeah Borderline yeah, yeah. disgusting smiles. Yeah, like, back in it. I guess the closest word to it would be gore, but it doesn't have to be bloody. It's just yeah, like right. freaky. Yeah. Um, And just how much, I guess, how much more possibility there is mm, within yeah. anime. I mean, I guess CGI is really advanced now, but- no. It just they like, like that. that's why every live action anime fails because Sucks. you take the anime aesthetic and you put it to live action, it it's never works same, out. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it works. It never works out. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's why initially like, I loved Attack on Titan so much. And I think just because I didn't keep up with it throughout the years. Mm. Yeah. But not, I'm now- I'm gonna finish it and maybe I'll still- Now's the yeah. perfect time because you could just marathon it now. We had to wait like fucking, like oh. I can't remember how many years we had to wait for season two. And I think now, it was like three or four years. Yeah, yeah. I will exactly, yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. why. I will happily marathon. I think I watched season two. Mm. Like first season one. on now? Uh, uh, we're on season four now. <laughs> no, we're, on, we're on season, yeah. we just finished season three, no, the final season part two. Yeah, yeah. And then it was the final yeah, season I mean. part one, but it isn't the final season because there is another final season that's coming out, which is the, the final season. The, the final, final, final season. season. But before this, there was yeah. season three part one, and then there was season three part two. Yeah. And now we're on the final season. Yeah. But then we're I, about to, I yeah. still think there's going to be a movie at the end. I don't know. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm really I'm, hoping I'm, I'm betting, yeah. I'm betting my money. More. Wait, because you like the whole This is just the Hobbit all season, over again. Season man. three is like the most hype season. Yeah, season yeah. three is really? fucking insane. Yeah. You will lose your shit. And that's yeah. after the basement? No, oh. no, no. Wait, you've, wait you, don't, you know oh. what's in the basement? I what? Or like, I remember talking about it with some friends. I want to say maybe. No, you'd know if you've seen the hype bits. You fucking, it's burned into my memory. Yeah. Okay. So you guys don't care about spoilers and stuff? Uh, no, 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 no. Spoiler alert. Spoiler warning for Attack on Titan. You guys want to watch? Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Spoiler warning. So because I watch certain parts of it throughout the years, it's almost hard to remember. I remember I watched the initial setup the first season. Yeah. yeah. And then a little bit more of them kind of fighting. Then you find out, oh my God, this person is a Titan too. Yeah. Oh my God, this person is a Titan. Yeah. Oh my God, this, oh my God, that, right? Yeah. And then something about the basement and then the storyline just lost me and I didn't. <laughs> okay, so you didn't get to the basement. Yeah, you, yeah, like yeah Guaranteed, yeah, yeah, yeah. like yeah. the basement I is- I didn't get to it. Yeah, they, yeah, they, yeah. They, you they, pro they probably talked about it yeah. a little bit initially, but I don't think you actually got to the basement. Yeah, they don't yeah, get yeah. into it until oh. some later- It's like season later. three, yeah. right? They don't uh, get to no, the final they, season. Yeah, no, oh, yeah. yeah that's right. The final season? No, no, they don't get to the basement until literally the last two episodes of season three, where they explain everything. And it's worth it. It's one of the few- that's it's good. one of the few really? shows. I'm goosebumps thinking about. Oh, yeah. okay. It's one of the few <laughs> shows that builds up this massive event yeah. and then delivers. Yeah, wow. right? it's it's okay, insane. I think I was like getting annoying waiting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Annoyed waiting. Yeah, well, there is there is a lot of backstory and so lore the basement well, yeah. that they have to explain. Because season yeah. two is like it's kind of really slow. And then season three initially is it not about Titans. Yeah. So mm. it's really it like- It gets very like political. You're like, yeah. what yeah. the fuck? But then yeah. it all makes sense. You're like, ah, oh, this is amazing. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. That sounds really exciting. It's, it's very hype. It's worth it. So yeah, watch Attack on Titan. Watch Attack on Titan. It is worth the hype. Yeah, yeah. it is. It is the mainstream anime that I think is just genuinely worth all this, like all the reputation all that right. it has. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, so sometimes I feel kind of bad talking about anime because <laughs> no, I feel I like don't. people are like, you watch anime casually, <laughs> fake fans. It's, it's, I'm like, <laughs> there's, a lot, right? there's a lot of emotions so, in there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but for me, legit, it's like, I've been watching since I was young. And it's just like, I'll just watch anime. Mm -hmm. here yeah, that's fine. Um, like Promise Neverland was great. Mm. Oh, that's all cool. season, well, season, season one. Season one, season one. Yeah. We don't, don't, talk, we about don't season. talk about season two. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So um, there's this one that I can't remember. It's it's new, it's on Netflix. It's uh, about the like, little it? boy who lives alone. Oh, Kotaro. That one. That oh, one oh, okay. So cute. Wow, you watched that? I watched like a few episodes. Oh, wow. See, that's how you know casual view. Yeah, yeah. You're on so Netflix and you're yeah, like, I'll yeah, just watch yeah. the first thing that comes yeah. out. Yeah. But it's good. It's just so cute. <laughs> <man>. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm not gonna be like, you should really watch it because the storyline, the character, but it's just like you watch it. Hey, whatever. That's just whatever. like slice of life anime yeah, in general, yeah, right? Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's hard enough finding anime that you enjoy watching. So if mm-hmm. you can get enjoyment out of a show, who the fuck gives a fuck? Yeah, yeah. yeah. who cares? Critically yeah. acclaimed or not. Right. Whatever. Like I uh, also watch Sword Art Online, probably like all the really popular ones, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I tried to watch RE0 and I couldn't. Any, do you guys R- R- big R- R- Re0, whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Re0, Re0. 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 You don't like Re0. Uh, Re0. 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 You don't like Re0? Sorry, because for me, it's like um, like when you're replying to an email. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Like, oh, Re0. Re, that one thing you said earlier. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I, like when you fucking said that, dude. It's like reply <laughs> zero. Reply zero. Reply zero. Yeah. You didn't like Re0? Why? Okay, no, let me explain. I watched like the first. um like two or three episodes. And for some reason, mm. I could not watch someone do the same thing over and over again, just to like get it right. Like I, yeah. that was tilting me, but I heard it's great. So I'm not gonna yeah. say it's bad. Yeah, they actually stopped doing that kind of, they don't do really? it as much. Yeah. Oh, actually, no, the first no, three episodes, uh, I'd say are probably uh, like, maybe actually, some of the weakest yeah, parts I, of the, the show. That's yeah, probably yeah. why I didn't yeah. finish it. Yeah, I mean like as a- I'm a three episode Andy. If I'm like, hooked three episodes in, I'm watching the whole thing. Right. Yeah, 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 exactly. I'm not. <laughs> if, like, go, the go thing about ReZero is that if you didn't like it in the first three episodes, you're not gonna like the series. It's probably not gonna be for you. Come if you didn't like ReZero. I love Rem so much. Everyone loves Rem. I'm, I'm so normal. I love it's, Rem. It's so it's it's like liking vanilla, you know. Whenever Aww. you go to Crane Games yeah. in Japan, there's always Rem figures. Always. Yeah, because she's yeah. The most, she's like the most no, popular legit. girl. I still see her everywhere. That's why I'm like, I don't, I do not hate the anime. Yeah. By the way, <laughs> I just did like, not finish it. Like I knew it was big. I when love I, Rem. When I saw Rem in round one here on the Crane yeah. Game, oh, I'm like, yeah. damn, Rem's gone international now. Hell yeah. Yeah. yeah, she's always been. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> that's yeah. true. That's true. Yeah. If you could pick one anime that you could watch on stream, no. Don't worry about DMCA <laughs> That's or a good copyright. Question. That's how you what should ask would it streamers be? actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's a great question. That's a really great question. <laughs> Loki, I might go back and say Avatar. <laughs> oh. oh! I mean, is Avatar not just like a great I haven't watched that audience? Avatar before. I've never I, I before. only recently watched Avatar because I didn't grow up with Nickelodeon. Yeah. It's fucking awesome. Is like, it? Yeah. I, it's absolutely, Honestly. I can totally see why the comparison of this is an anime and this is not an anime plays because it, you know, technically speaking, it's not an anime, but like it certainly gives the feeling of like a yes. really fucking good show in an anime. It yeah. Does. Yeah. It does. Um, but if you're asking me like to stream, yeah, I gotta think like a content creator. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Let's get the most okay. One piece. Yeah, one piece. One piece. One piece. I was about to say, if I could choose, it would yeah. be One Piece because it's literally <laughs> endless so hours of content. Like, yeah. Or, or maybe Attack yeah. on Titan because like, Yo, that would, dude, okay. could you imagine like the reactions to the, the twists and the yeah. turns, right? yeah, bro? Yeah. And there's like insane fight scenes. Yeah. I think it's a little, I think it would probably drive more viewership than mm-hmm. like uh, oh, Avatar. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Avatar is yeah, a little dude. bit slower at times or yeah. more wholesome or mm. about the story, which again, storyline I mean, with stream. Yeah. Something you know, like as much it. as I, I, I'm i like, I don't think reaction videos like the best stuff. I, I, you know, you, sometimes you want to watch people's reactions to like the fights, the people who yeah. react way too hard to things yeah. on yeah. YouTube. Yeah. Oh, my <laughs> oh my God, and they start fucking freaking out. Yeah. And it's like nothing. Well, that, well, that, well, you know, <laughs> well, that's why that's why Etika was such a thing, right? Yeah, yeah, like yeah, everything yeah. he yeah. reacted to was, either wholesome His or just like insane. So yeah. Like he yeah. was more of the entertainment than the thing he was. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Right, exactly. so that's yeah. why it's hard to say reaction content bad or reaction mm, content yeah. good. Like yeah. it, there's a lot of It's a spectrum. It. See, yeah. I'm an awful reactor. Like I-, I Yeah, me too. Like, like, I, I remember I like- I like that. Yeah. yeah like, Keeps watching. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, just, cool. I, just, I just like have commentary on my mind and sometimes it's just like- She's got like the Linus, cool. the Linus retirement face. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't react to shit while I watch it. I react to it like afterwards. I have to yeah, pause, I have it. to pause. Yeah, I have then, to pause. Then people get pissed off like, fucking pause. I know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Pause. But, then, but then sometimes I try to commentate as I'm going along yeah. and he's I'm like, can you just pause? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just yeah. every 10 seconds. Yeah. Actually, uh, <laughs> Actually, this remind me. <laughs> 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 what? What did you say? Wait, what did you just say? speaking of crack. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it's like I got so many things like will trigger take a train that. of thought for me. I think that's part of the streamer lifestyle, you know. Yeah. But also, when people content. ask me about React content, I'm not here to be like, "This is my opinion and what is okay. right." Whatever. Okay. Yeah. The way what I think is like, I cannot wait for surely the day, whether it's in two, five, ten, twenty years. When co-watching things, yeah, becomes yeah, like yeah, like yeah. Well, the Anderson norm. sort of, kind of is starting to try and do it, but there it's is not that. Still it's not too that, much yeah. like copyright and limitations. If that was, um, if that was like allowed, that would be the next meta, hundred yeah. yeah. percent. Because being able to like 
watch something mm. with someone who's watching it yeah. with the reactions oh, of yeah. tens yeah. of thousands of people at once. Like there's just, a, there's no, it's an unparalleled experience. No, I agree. Yeah, an yeah, unparalleled I, totally agree. Experience. I would if I could, yeah. I'd love to. Yeah. Oh. I mean, we've been trying to convince Japanese companies for like oh, years now. you're not the only one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're yeah. not the only one. One day, one, one day. Yeah. One final question. What is this, Um, you know your profile picture on Twitch? What's with this green circle thing that everyone's doing? Oh, okay, so basically, I mean, you know when you're on Twitch, you see all the people that yeah. are live? Mm. The green circle is just something that makes someone stand out. Do you, th do you think it actually d improves viewership or through click-through rate or anything like that? Have you, have you seen this? Yeah, 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 definitely. And I've always wondered, I was like, oh, is this like a perk of like the top streamers? I, I, I like, thought it was like, like, I thought it was like an no, Instagram thing where it's like close friends. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> no, but they, I think they added something like that too. Like Twitch stories? No, but there's like a circle around when it says live. That's on YouTube, right? No, there's something on Twitch as well. Oh, really? really? Yeah. I don't remember exactly off the top of my head, no. but they added a circle themselves huh. too. Yeah. Hmm. But the one that people just draw on and put on their yeah, like you, you icon, to, go. to me, I mean, you know, I can't give you direct yeah. analytics, yeah. but I, I feel I, like I, it I, makes I, sense yeah. at to what me. Point, I, 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 I just wanted to know, I just wanted to know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But at what point does it turn into like fucking <laughs> red arrow, like you know, yeah. pointing at the face? You it's won't like, believe what's <laughs> happening in this Twitch <laughs> stream. Yeah. That's like, how thumbnails work. I feel like it's one of those things that's like, it's just a step I'm gonna try it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think my background is green. So maybe- Yeah, <laughs> I, don't yeah. I don't think it will work for your profile. Yeah, I, don't know. I, did, I think like... I might swap the color of mine. Ooh. Ooh. I see people do pink. Oh. New meta, yeah. new meta coming swap along. Swap the colors. Yeah, cause I remember I, I was talking to Toast and he was like, yeah, streamers just copy each other. Yeah. Like, yeah. like one person can be like, yeah, All this- All content creators do. Yeah, they do, they do. Um, but like he was saying like, yeah, streamers copy each other, even if there's yeah. like no, basis around it. It just like feels right. Like, <laughs> yeah. what's your source? Mm -hmm. Trust me, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah What's right? your source? I made it the fuck up. Yeah. Yeah. Not fuck just up. that, but there's this interesting phenomenon on Twitch, which I don't really love, but essentially like when something becomes the norm, if you're not keeping up- You're the weirdo. Bye. Yeah, yeah. yeah. right, right. It's yeah. like, you really, you have it's to be brutal. on top of your right. shit all yeah. the time, yeah. Yeah. which is tiring. <sighs> But I guess it keeps it a little. How you stay on the top, man? Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. But that's why. number see, one, man. If you see all the top streamers yeah. are watching movies on their stream, yeah. yeah. Like, well, if I don't do it, yeah. I mean, you know, if you miss out on one trend or meta here yeah. and there, it's not a big deal. But yeah. if you're continuously avoiding these opportunities, where like clearly the majority of the traction and exposure mm. and yeah. traffic mm -hmm. is going mm -hmm. to, yeah. It's not, it's gonna be- It's like, gonna be detrimental. It, it'll, yeah. yeah, it'll yeah. be detrimental to your career, obviously. Yeah. Mm. Damn, well, thank yeah. you for giving us all your insights. And, yeah, yeah. Uh, hey, look, tips and tricks. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, look at all these patrons though. Do you yeah. see them flying across the screen? They support oh the show. Yeah. Is that one okay? <laughs> <laughs> Why, what, right? Why, what happened? Yeah. They're just going everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, hey, if you want to support the show, go over to our Patreon, patreon.com slash trash taste. Also follow us on Twitter, send us your memes on the subreddit. And if you hate our face, listen to us on Spotify. And uh, yeah, go check out Pokestop. Do you have anything yeah, you want to shout out? Do you want to shout out anything? Um, um, I guess that's a no. Yeah. <laughs> World peace and love. <laughs> And Koei water. Very good filtered <laughs> water. Oh I love no, it. no, no. It's really, no. really good for Well, thank you for water. watching. Uh, thank you very much. much. And be nice to other human beings, even <laughs> through a screen. Oh. Um, yeah. Also, these guys are freaking great. Like, I have felt very comfy and happy oh, since, yeah. yeah, since meeting you guys, doing this podcast. We'll PayPal you later. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah, 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 so much. much. No PayPal. <laughs> 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 we'll, uh, oh, we'll... calling you. <laughs> Thank you guys very Yeah, much. don't worry, we'll, 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 we'll sub later. <laughs> yeah, we'll sub later. Tier three. Yeah, tier, tier, three. Three. Tier, tier three, tier three sub. Tier three sub. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, thanks for watching guys, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. Bye.